All right, we're live. Hopefully. Allegedly. Surprisingly unergonomic on my phone. Oh yeah, which bonus round we will mm. probably see today? Whether or not we uh, get through the inventor bonus round. We shall see. Yeah, so we've got two bonus rounds left. Mm -hmm. uh, and then whatever's have... behind door number three. Yeah, exactly. Bonus door. Mm -hmm. All of those sixes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we did Jester because we enjoy the Jester. They are fun to play. And we're pretty good at the Jester. Yes. All right. So we. They are full chaos mode. We are probably gonna start <coughs> with uh, some Inventor, despite the stream title. <laughs> we're gonna go Invent. So right to normal. Can you go down a floor? Bonus rules. All oh, right. Bo 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 bonus. With the inventor, which sounds terrifying. She is oh, pretty. No, no, no. Mm. Oh, ah. All right. A whip um, or a whip, shovel? Um, I mean, I think it's the shovel. I do enjoy shovels. Like, normal weaken isn't as good as Parallel Universe weaken, but weaken is still pretty fucking good. So I think we're going to go ahead and go with the shovel. Seems reasonable. Also get a spanner and a capacitor. It makes sixes pretty well. Mm. And we're gonna lose something, which is gonna be yep. fun. <laughs> we'll have to pick what we lose. Yep. All right, pop. 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 Hmm. Copy a random dice. Well, I guess we could um. We could put the one in the capacitor and copy. Oh, we could combine. True. Oh, I guess now we can put the one and combine and get six. That's kind of what I'm thinking, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yours would get us a bit more, but Into the capacitor, right across but, the two of them, yeah. yeah. But that's fine. Nice. No effect! Aww. Yeah, you get that no Aww. effect. Alright, uh, well, we combine and we win. Yeah, and then the question is, what do we get rid oh, of? Oh, good god. Um... I feel like it's the spanner, because I feel like always, 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 we are running out we of damage. We do need to be able to do damage more we than anything We run else. out of damage more than anything else. Damage is very so... important. Fortunately, it's the spanner. <laughs> <laughs> and then we get damage. Not good damage, mind, you know. Glad like, to have it, at least. We'll get rid of it. Yes. We, we will throw it against Hothead. I mean, it's actually pretty good for Hothead, right? Is Hothead I believe down? so. Sure is. You can so, combine all dice. You know, we are gonna do, um, like 12, 12 damage. damage. Oh. Seems fine. That's, you know, I can live with that. Focus, which is all dice, becomes six. Do not need. Goodbye. All right. So, Hopefully, so, get another dice. Yes. Uh, we're definitely throwing this. I away. think so. Yes. Nice. Always good. Let's see what we get. Ah, whisper. Okay, so we can right. go super weaken. Scrap bump. Mm. Dice value plus one always offered a scrap. That's all right. All good things. That's pretty good. Be interesting to see the expanded scrap pool in here, because a lot of that was just. One the, of your uh, dice is frozen. Yeah. Ooh, that's not. That's really not good. The inventor doesn't really. Yeah, the inventor likes big dice. Come the on. question is: chaos. Is chaos mode worse? Chaos. <laughs> Oh, balls. 
Brew scrap poison yeah, to the, the second uh, choice is hidden. Yeah, ah! yeah, that's uh, that's, that's the, uh, the worry. The the thingy. The, yeah. Um, we we did one of the one of the rounds has that rule. I can't yes. remember which one. Um. Oops. Oh well. All right. That's just how it be sometimes. Well, we're gonna lose two bits of gear and hopefully, well, it will be scrap bump and it's scrap bump probably... will be one. Probably whisper the other. Well, well let's we'll see how it goes. Like, and roll. No reason not to let it ride. We can do four ice damage. We sure can. So it's worth asking if we want to. So capacitor does uh, four damage and a shock to him. Yes. Um, so I mean, can... I definitely use a shovel. So it's yeah. probably then just like all shovel sixes. and two capacitors. Yeah, I like that. Wow. Wow. Like that sets us up for success, I would say. It's all right. I have a bomb. Um, that should uh, if we get bump us to the win. one yeah. and put those two in, uh. I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure we have lethal here thanks to the weakness. Yeah. To shock. Alright, so it's the scrap bump, roll a six. Mm -hmm. Alright. You like to roll a six. Alright, uh, it's definitely the pirate. Pirate, yeah, has a lot more behind it. Alright, hopefully, uh... <laughs> we'll, we'll see, see what we'll see what we lose. Alright, roll a six. Perfectly okay with that. We can even throw that one in the whisper. Yeah, we definitely... Uh, Weaken the shit out of him. Of course, those two statuses... Yeah, we can and shock definitely. Can mess I up feel like each they other. fixed it, though. Possibly. I, I, I definitely have seen them conflict less. Yeah. Um, since 1.8. Who knows if that's true. That might just be <laughs> my... Uh... You're saying. All right, we're not getting any weakened, but no. we should get... Two capacitors? Yes. To the four in, six in, and then... Uh, even dump a two in. And he's shocked to shit. Uh, yeah, ah, yeah, definitely do that, just happened yeah. there. Oh, right. we do level. We level so. so. The roll of six is actually pretty nice for this. Yeah, that's like good. Good to All note right. that Scrap Bump turns into that. All right. All right. How's it gonna go? Uh, okay. That's easy enough. That's good. Yep. For your damage. Alright, oh, chainsaw. Uh, two sixes, two damage if enemy HP is filled with double. So do 24 damage if it's the or first hit. Double twice, double dice value. Two. Uh, Fascinating. Uh, we're probably getting rid of whatever it is, honestly, mm -hmm. at some point. Um, do you want to take the chainsaw for maximum fun? Yeah, that sounds hilarious. Like, it is 12 damage. <laughs> Hell yeah! No. Finally. No. No, no. All right. Um. Change machine must be equal four. Return four one. Oh, let's try something out. Um. So apparently, if you like. Go back. Yeah. It doesn't spend the money. Okay. okay, that's good to know. Someone commented on that. Even, even. Do damage. That's way better. Now it's three damage. That's of course even, even. <laughs> Chaos! Chaos! I gotta say, like, chain upgraded chainsaw seems like something you could build around. Mm. Yeah. Cause like, double evens is so much easier than double Wanna sixes. Wanna try it? We could always give it a shot, yeah. It's all it's a little ballsy, like going for an upgrade rather than buying. Well, this run is but... pretty ballsy because of our first rule. Very anyway, fair. So. Uh, well, do you want to do twenty-four damage to him? I, I do want to do 24 damage. Oh. Um, oh. Balls. That's fine. Learning Damn experience. It. Damn it. That was, that was dumb. That was stupid. Sorry, I couldn't stop you. No, I know. That was just because I was dumb. All right. He's dead next turn regardless. I thought it was like first turn. Mm. I, I was like, I, I thought it was on the first turn right. to do damage. I was like, no, it's when enemy HP is full, idiot. But yeah, like the big thing about... Chainsaw Plus is that, like, 
You just put any two twos in it and it's like... That's, that's ridiculous. Yeah. Like, that's a super sword and it's in a small slot. I would play that as like a two slot weapon. I think we can probably. That's probably fine. We do. We have the double-edged sword and the shovel right now. Like all of our stuff is currently attack weapons. Yeah, I wouldn't want to like get rid of that. I think the chainsaw is really the one thing we're trying to hold on to here. Keyblade. Keyblade's pretty nice. It's just do we want to buy scrap or do we want to hold on to our save. money? That's a tough one because of course scrap bump is a pretty good upgrade. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, Live dangerously. You never really know what you're gonna get. Nope. Run. Uh, yeah, we've seen this do good. That's, that, yeah. that's a good rule. That's just actively a good rule. You can use your shovel twice. The enemy gets extremely confused. Yes. Um, we can even use the chainsaw twice. Yes, if we have four dice to dump in it, I think. Because, of course, it's the equipment that gets reused here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, well, so we, we can will, do 20 damage. Uh, we will get... Um... Ooh, yeah. You could actually do re-equip on the Keyblade, right? And that would just do three, or... No, I... I... If you use the chainsaw, you're allowed to use the chainsaw again. Yes, yes, yes. We don't um, have enough dice for that, though. No, so yeah. Um, yeah, that probably is just a keyblade thing extra, so it is probably just... Uh, it, it would we can, twice, it would, yeah. We would get no damage on that. I think I think 20 damage, 10 damage is worth it. We get less damage by reusing this. Yes. So. Yeah, I think just doing the 20 damage is where we want to be here. I'm wondering, because we get six in here. It's four less damage, but we do two more damage with shovel and we get one weaken. I think that might be worth it. Unless we kill her. Do we kill her? Uh, well, let's see. 20 oh, plus we kill her. three plus... Yeah, she's dead we if we her. do that. Chainsaw, Keyblade, Shovel is enough. Yeah, we can beat trees. Yeah, like, now, when it's double sixes, it's like, you won't be able to use that most turns. When it's double evens, you'll be able to use that basically every turn, especially as we start getting more dice. All right, scrap club, I'll take. Yeah. Anything we can use to preserve our uh, weapons is good. Plastic okay, heart, really care Ooh, about... do damage, recover one health. So that's oh, pretty nice that's actually not bad. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. That'll probably be something we pick up at uh, like once we have the, the money end, for it. Yeah, Although we'll right. also see what's in shop number two. Yes, of course. I, I, yeah, I always feel like I'm always running out of money on the inventor. Yes, well, because you want like even mediocre gear is good for the inventor. Well, we could just do 24 damage. Um. Again, or... Okay. No. Oh no. What's the strap club? Do we have? Well, I think I think that's a murder. Twenty-four plus three is seven plus eight. Yeah. You could even chainsaw again. Alright, one damage. Woo! The scrap club doesn't turn into anything good. It's weird no. a scrap um. Play one dice turn the other, interesting. Right, we've seen that one. Bump, bump just, just nice. Flat bump, what's in this shop? Um, Flytrap for one gold is definitely a nice thing to see. Yeah, so we don't want to buy anything else. I guess I can really only buy one thing yes, from either I shop. Yes, I think actually you could buy the Elastic Heart ah, and, and the, the Flytrap. Yeah, that's interesting. Um, and that might just be it for the sheer amount of gear. Um... Would we want to slot double edge in just to kind of get rid of it at some point? I know it's much tougher and with the rule we've imposed yeah, on ourselves. Yeah, the damn rule we've got, yeah. But it's also just, you know, give it a chance for something we're perfectly happy to throw away. Alright. Yes. The Yeti. Is Yeti weak to chainsaw? Isn't everything weak to chainsaw? 
That's right. 20 damage. Yep. God. Uh. I don't win, so I'm just gonna do the uh, five in here. That's fair. We don't need to take four damage for no reason. Nope. I was like, if it goes yeah. the win, we do it. Oh, absolutely. But not otherwise. Like, we're totally fine now. Yeah, we win. Now we get to see what we lose. Mm -hmm. ah! Got him. Ah! Nope. All right. Dial up sounds. Ooh, okay. Yeah. Uh, we definitely replaced that with the uh, Venus flytrap. Yep. All right. We're actually doing pretty okay for attacking items right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we are actually doing good. Uh, oh, are we fine with the Kraken? Not able to see enemy health no. after the first try? Yeah, you mean after fine. we do 300 damage it's fine. to them? That's fine. Ooh. Oh, that's new. I've never new. seen him before. Yeah, I've no, we have never seen him. Okay, well, I think it's the wicker man. Yeah, chest and an apple. Fortunately, one of these apples is useless. It's fine. So we do have focus, which means that we could chainsaw twice if we want. The wicker man is dead as shit, yeah. We can even weaken three. That chainsaw, then keyblade, then chainsaw. As in you, as of, uh, yeah. Ah. So, yeah, we keyblade and we To do 12 more damage. That just did 36 damage. And we weakened all of his gear. Yup. So. Oh, no! He couldn't use the Venus Flytrap at all. And he got the weakened burn, so rough for him. Mm -hmm. All right. I believe he's just dead. I don't think we even need to take the burn damage. Nope. I'll try to keep track of what his health stops at. It shouldn't yep. take too Goodbye. long. Goodbye. Gain a random, random blessing. blessing. Ah, it's chaos mode. Mm hmm. All right. That's good to know. Let's uh, try this out. Right on. Nice filler. Okay. Um. Uh, all right. Try to keep some good gear. Mm hmm Elastic card's weird. I'm not sure how, like, good good it is. Like, it's three damage. Um, max, but that right. is nice to have. Rain monster is. Like. What are you, buddy? <laughs> hey! Strong, Strong against, against poison. poison, huh? What is your, uh... Alright, we only have one even. Yeah. Alright. What's his moveset like? Add two poison. poison and oh, it's like a grown up version of the slime. Uh, yeah. Alright, well, we get one six. Oh, uh, I love him. Good for like Venus Flytrap. Mm -hmm. um, we can even re equip it. Um, you could? Oh, um, if you bump two things, they turn, they'll both turn oh, even. Oh, yeah, because it re equips. Yes. Sure. Probably start useful, with that, but I guess it doesn't really matter going forward. I was worried it would it would do something weird in terms of the uh, re equip, mm -hmm. but all right, well, fuck it, right now. Ah. He has five health, which uh, I think we're okay. Yeah, he has like no health. Yep. <laughs> Love's giving us armor blessings. Alright, we can't get a six, that's fine. Um, yeah, we just win. Yep. I can definitely see the blind rule being bad with the if you overkill take damage rule. Yes, there are times that would make that really bad. Hmm. I'm kinda okay with doing it on this fly trap. Yeah. Like, again, it's nice, but we're actually doing kind of okay for damage stuff. We're slowly starting to go down, but, like, we've got the chainsaw, the ray gun, and the keyblade even before the elastic heart. 
I mean, one thing about the inventor is that, like, in a normal run, you can keep two items, like, just fine, as long as you're willing to give up anything else. Yes, yeah, so the first rule we got was, uh, mean. Alright, well, I guess dupe a four and a two. Yeah, I'm gonna re equip it, so we can. Get even more twos. I was really hoping. <laughs> I was really, Christ. really hoping for a uh, duplicate and a four there. Yep. Well, as long as we survive, we level here. All right, twenty-seven. Yep, twenty-seven. Oh, we're getting cursed. As tends to happen. Oh, right, re-equip fucks him up. Kraken just gets completely destroyed by re-equip, of course. He, he sure do. Well, that was a tough one. I'm hoping. <laughs> yep. Such is... Indeed. He should be really low health now. Okay, we're yes. getting cursed. Oh, we can from the E blade or elastic heart with the blind dice. Oh, I mean, mostly for the curse. Oh yeah, you're right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there we go. Now we can chainsaw it to death. Not dead! Sweet Jesus. Dead now! <laughs> Beautiful. Nope. That's fine. Yeah, that means our next fight's gonna be pretty good. Scrap uh, spear, ooh. six damage always offered by scrap, or do we want two chainsaws? I don't know if we want another chainsaw. Because we can't you can't get the the double effect twice. Yes, that is true. Um uh, do we want anything else to copy though? Although like Well see it needs four even dice to change. Yes, off. that makes it a lot tougher. Oh the focus It would at least allow us to have a second one if we lose one. Um True, spare chainsaw to scrap isn't awful. I'm trying to think, like, I don't know if we want to copy anything else we have. That is also the question, And I don't yeah. know if we want to upgrade anything Upgrading, we have. like, we can get something else that's decent, but there's also a decent chance we lose it. Yes. Look at two chainsaws. Two chainsaws! People demanded it. People demand two chainsaws! We can even, like, not have it in to start with. Ah! Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Kind of just hold it in uh, reserve for a bit. What did Chainsaw say it was? I've already forgotten, like, what it would turn into as a gadget. It was offered to us, and I didn't, uh, make oh, note I, of it. Oh, I didn't, I didn't even look at that, no, I... No. We should probably, uh, just take a look. Mmm, that one's always tasty. Um, we do kill things pretty hard. Ah, oh, right, five yeah. weekend once. Yes, dial-up noise. That's what it is. Uh, that is a tough one. Like, we've been killing things pretty heftily, um, but 10 health is definitely a lot. And of course, the further we go in, the less the chainsaw's effect is going to just, you know, get us straight across the finish line. We still have to actually finish the fight, but it might still be better than a totally be random. Than, like, we can definitely get like some real bad final roll. So I might just take That's that. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Yeah. Hey, Loudbird. Well, bird. hopefully we can chainsaw the fuck out of Loudbird. <laughs> I think we have focus. Ah, okay. no, uh, no, not quite. Okay, right. well, let's attempt to duplicate a six, shall yes. we? I might. Try the three. I don't think it matters actually what we do. <laughs> yeah. Three seems fine. I'm wondering if we want to re. Uh, no. We... <sighs> More damage to re equip the chainsaw. Mm -hmm. If we can get a second, even. 
potentially do. Oh, well, we can with like the bump. It's only uh -huh. six damage. Though. Yeah. If we do this, we re-equip it, but we get 20. I think it's worth attempting the. Uh, we get 24 damage. Hey. It sure is. Do I wanna? It doesn't really matter. Yeah, we don't actually have a use for another six. No. It's mostly that like, gives me two attempts to get six. Exactly, and that considering like the extra six would have was eight more damage. Yeah. Like that's extremely worth it. Can duplicate it too. Uh, woo! Woo! We have too many dice for this. We do. Got, like twenty. So. Oh, we're getting silent. Okay. Let's dodge. Yeah. All right, so we can bump in. We probably just put the one and a one in the chainsaw for the dodge. Yeah, and the keyblade. Key I meant the keyblade. Yep. Um, then bump the three into a four. Do ten damage. Yeah. That seems reasonable. Oh, he had ten health. Ah. That works. Fair enough. <laughs> this is fine. Um. <coughs> yeah. I'm I think okay. that's okay. Yeah. Again, if it's not the chainsaw, I'm not going to be too, too worried about it. Although having the second chainsaw means we don't worry as much about losing the chainsaw. Yeah. All right, grab that. We do have an upgrade. Mm -hmm. Another mosquito bite. Yay. Um, so the keyblade is four, elastic heart is, ah, and recovers health. Right. Photo makes it small, but honestly, we don't, we don't really have too much running, that we want to put in it. We're running out of, uh... Yeah, what's the uh, mosquito bite? Two health. Ooh. No, um... I might hold off on this uh, upgrade until mm -hmm. we've done some more fights. Yes, we might or see might not finish keeping. here, but we'll see. Yeah, see what we keep a hold of. Yeah. I and mean, we keep a hold of Elastic Heart or um, Keyblade. Yeah. Um, then we want to upgrade that. Yep. I'm it's also, even, like, of course, worth shot. asking if we would want to just go straight to the boss after we kill Rat King here. Yes, Which, yes. We'll see. Yes, we'll see what's in the shop. With 30 right health, it might be a bit dangerous, but yeah. yeah. We'll we'll reevaluate. That's a good start. Oh, well, that's beautiful. Especially with that um, mega bump. The mega bump, again, it doesn't really do anything. <laughs> um, we can re-equip it um, with sixes. Because we get three sixes. Oh, but then we have a three and a one. Uh, you could duplicate. Um, I think you can chainsaw twice here. Well, that's what I'm saying. But um, if I bump, then I get a, a six and a three and a one. We do have the duplicate. Potential duplicate. Yeah, you do. You can have more dice and moves. I guess there's not really much reason not to mega bump unless yeah. we're. Because really, if we do use the befuddle first, then we don't get the double chainsaw anyway. No, if I put the two in the chainsaw, I'm pretty sure it would come a three and go here. You're saying if I put it in there and then mega bumped, would it stay a Oh, no, no, that, that wasn't what I was... No, that's what, oh, yeah. that's what chat was saying. Okay. Sorry, I was just very confused there. Yeah, I, I think we just chainsaw and then uh, we see what happens. Well, I can always bump because you no. Know, there's no reason not. I get some extra ones out of That's kind of what I'm thinking, yeah. And there we go. Yep, it happens. Yep. Um, like, I don't think we even really missed out on that much damage there. Well, it would have been... Well, we might have... I don't think we would have gotten the kill, but we would be... He would be re Is that 11? Okay. 
going to get freaked out by the re-equip. He sure is. He sure did. Means we're fine. All right, we win. Random status effect. Random status effect, alright. Fascinating. Spanner. Spanner seems pretty good. There's no reason not to buy the healing crystal, honestly. Yeah. So yeah, now it comes down to if we want to fight these things, these guys to level, or if we want to just take the boss on, um, like an upgraded thing. I feel like we're pretty strong, honestly, with this. Yeah, I guess it we're really comes down to the health. 30 health. Yeah, we only get, like, what, six more health? Or six um, more health, yeah. And we get to keep all this. We have a lot of healing now. Um, So we could upgrade the Elastic Heart and then we have even more healing. And that would be better than losing the elastic heart mm -hmm. um or the keyblade or the chainsaw yeah and then hopefully I, I the spanner rather... also helps us get uh it should help evens. us get evens yeah. yeah if we combine um two, two odds, odds it will turn into evens. two evens yeah. yes or ain't even yes if it's less than six like, the, the bonus might be an extra dice, but honestly, we're having so many dice. Yep. That might be less of a problem now that we have two chainsaws, but... I also can't remember what our gadget is. The spanner... It's the random turn. status effect. Right. Okay, so Elastic Heart... I think Elastic Heart is where... The health might just... The, the, the health heal healing. might just help us overcome... Uh, us dying horribly. Yeah, and that's like max four. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's the. Uh... I think so. And yeah, I think we're just better off. Yeah, it's mostly down here. to just surviving long enough with this low with this low health. All right. Well, let's roll the dice. Not Drake. Buster. Hey, Buster. Alright, is Buster gonna fuck us up? That's a good question. Okay, uh, Buster does not care about re-equip, I believe. We'll see if it fucks him up for a turn, but, like, he has a billion things to do. Yeah. Alright, uh, Ren, uh, it probably hold off around the sense Although... Shouldn't matter, it shouldn't hurt him, right? Yeah. That's Oh, we pretty cursed good. him. That's <laughs> very good. Okay. So um, we're unfortunately not getting a huge boost off of... Uh, yeah, so we can make a four. Yeah, um, to do 20? Or... 12? 12. Yeah. I think that is... I think that is worth it. Probably. Yeah, I mean, it's... I'd rather not, like, totally waste a turn, I think. Just to wait to get 24 damage next turn. Oh god, oh god, no. Absolutely not. Alright, and then we'll do... And then we just keep punching him till he dies, hopefully. Oh, he got confused by re-equip. Nice. Yeah, re-equip seems to really mess up enemies with countdown equipment. They yeah. don't, like, understand it at all. Ooh, we can get, um... Oh, nice. Shock. Um, we can get two sixes. Yep. If he ever does damage to us, we'll be able to do a turn where we do 24 damage with two chainsaws. 27 with a keyblade. Do 24 damage do to him. 16 damage to us, so yeah, I think we just. Yeah, uh, most. We go down to 18, and yep. that's fine. Uh, let's go ahead and focus. 
And then ideally focus again next turn and pray we live. Um, yes, one of them goes in the Keyblade. One goes in the Keyblade, don't forget, extra damage. Get 27 damage. damage. And we'll hope that gets us across the line. Yep. Okay. I took a burn, excellent. We're only getting two more there. We're now in the danger zone, but we do have... We're fine. I'm pretty sure we kill him in this. Mm-hmm. Oh. Focus. Hey, All got right, there. We did it. I can't believe that worked. And this is why you don't give up a run. <coughs> Sometimes they do go. I will say in. Kraken does make these fights more exciting because yeah. I am not going to spend the mental effort to keep track of it beyond, like, you know, the basics. Well, because we got a chainsaw and then got the upgrade right yes. away. Yeah, the upgrade honestly saved that chainsaw. I would have been willing to throw it away, but honestly, upgraded chainsaw is nuts. It's good, yeah. Ridiculous. <laughs> well, that only took 30 minutes. All right, all right. Now it's time for the witch. All right, witch go. Nice. It's not even like On build around Dursi. so much as... It's ridiculous. It's a small slot. Yep. Any set of evens. <laughs> All right. Flower pot, daffodil. So, um, so four gets one mana. Um, we definitely had fun with this daffodil. So I wonder if we want to do this. Try we... out flower pot, see how that goes. Yeah, we, we definitely, the mana is definitely weird. Um, yeah, neither of these is very good. Neither of these are amazing. Um, but Flower we Pot is down. also like a free reroll, which is always nice. Yeah, absolutely. Right. That's on one. Yep, one and, and two. two. All right, Rose, we go. Rose, we go. Yeah, we actually got through the mana run like first time, so we haven't really like had a chance to uh, really come to grips with it. I think. Yeah. Kind of funny how we have literally nothing to do with uh, our mana. Yeah. Mm. If I'm not doing any damage, is uh. Yep. Doesn't really give you an effect other than the mana. So if we had mm. mana, a mana payoff, we'd be in good shape. Yeah. Second infliction, at least. Right. Yeah. Ah. Let's see what spell we get. Yeah. Yeah, mana is all mana. If you do spent. a thing with a mana effect and you have the mana, it will just do the stronger thing, yes. Chat and shield, add shield, plus more shield. Woo! Yeah, I don't like that one bit. All right. Um... Four slot. So f the one thing about the four slot, yeah, because we hate the four slot. It's supposed to go into flower pot, basically. Yeah. Um. So I think it's fine to put something like that in it. <laughs> Not the greatest payoff. Well, hey, if this run fails fast, we'll get another set of starting equipment. Woo! The pick from. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> We really just don't care about Anna yet. I mean, it's good to, like, bear it in mind. This is basically, like, try to get as many inflictions as possible. Yeah. Not we hit with 10 damage next turn. No, well, that is two inflictions. Then we kill him next turn no matter what. Yep. Boom. Well, I have crystal ball for the next fight. I just don't care about sheep. No. Ever. Very rarely. Like, you need payoffs. Alright, Sunbeam, fine. 
five cost two double damage. We definitely had some fun. That's with the that magic before. missile of parallel worlds, or at least one of the magic missiles yeah, of parallel worlds. Yeah, an electric truck has been damaged plus one shot. Um. Sunbeam would at least be a payoff for our mana. Yes. Though we have already taken it. Uh, I think I ran out of that. Uh, on the three or on the five? Five when we get to three. Fives can't go in Yes, flower fives flower. can't go in flower. Like, fives and sixes right now are actually kind of not good for us, so I think that, yeah, five's fine. And we want to be odd, because we want to put evens in Yes, because right? we want to put evens in the sunbeam. Alright, onwards. Onto the witch, that's kind of awful. That's real bad. Uh, alright. Chaos mode! We definitely, it definitely was like... Uh <laughs> <laughs> Man, this is just going great. Oh no! Alright, so that's a shop. Oh, no! These two are, these three are enemies. Oh, no. Those are probably apples and that's a chest. You know that, oh boy. But welcome to chaos mode! Who knows what we're gonna end up fighting? Oh no! <laughs> what an amazing roll! Oh, hi, Sneezy! Hey, Sneezy! What's up, Sneezes? Well, we're gonna get some mana. We're not gonna be able to spend anything with it. Ah! Alright, well, we're gonna get two inflictions. Right. Probably just throw that last dice because what else are we gonna do with our lives? Yeah, we're going maximum dicey. Also, ooh. Ooh, shit. No fives for us. No fives no. allowed. That is a five. Okay, That's a five so we right can there. do the double damage with the two of the either one, really. Good next turn. Yep. We're gonna take nine damage. Yeah, this is better than a blind dice oh. turn, but um. Ugh. <laughs> a blind dice every turn is just so. For the witch specifically. The, the witch, yeah. The witch is like you really need to know what dice you have. Yes. On the witch. Like having a dice that you don't know what it is is so fucking rough. All right, what's in the shop? Uh, ooh. Um, Blood Cauldron's actually just a better cauldron. Yeah, it's my, um, I guess it's a question of if we just want to abandon the, uh, mana or not. Yeah, I feel like we'll get another, um, we'll get another source of mana increase. Mm -hmm. The thing about the flower is it does no damage, which yep. drives me crazy, and it's a yep. max four. Blood Cauldron is also just... Dummy strong as far as cauldrons yeah, go. Yeah, blood cauldron. Like drain one health means that excellent. We're there's a two health swing every time, and you roll a new dice. Yeah, I feel like it just goes over flower pot. I think so. Like I feel weird putting cauldrons in any spot that isn't one, because you kind of want your ones for a lot of other stuff. Yeah, it's mimic rule. Everything's a chest. Everything's a chest, baby. Yeah, so hopefully we'll get a new source of uh, mana um, gain. Yeah, ideally. Um, but honestly, the flower one is really awkward as mana gains. One mana yes. if a four. One mana mind. if you have a four, and that means you have to throw away your four, so your four slot's just gone. Alright, I'm picking up a heart, <laughs> yep. and then we're fighting. Fighting that guy. It's good that we've played so many rounds, because I know what almost all of these floor layouts look like. <laughs> and, like, Sunbeam is still pretty decent as is. Oh, I'm fine. Like, it's, damage, it's five I damage. Mean. It doesn't have the eight damage of Magic Missile, but you're still perfectly happy with it. You have two Inflictions and a Madden, uh, a Sunbeam. Yeah, shield is awful. Okay, he put on teleport. Okay, okay, it's gonna dodge, that's um, fine. So we don't, I guess we probably just dump an Infliction in that, or a Blood Cauldron, like we don't get the dice back, but be okay. Yeah. Just do eight damage to him, that seems fine. I'll probably Infliction and then Blood Cauldron and Infliction is on me. True. Try to keep my uh, even. Yeah. Yes, that is important. Witch V Wizard. Mm. Mm. A 
Okay, shock, not great. Two shocks, yeah, a little shock, awkward for killing bad. off this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think we should still get it though, because you just Blood Cauldron, free one of these, free the Sunbeam, and then that and an Infliction will do it. Yeah, Blood Cauldron's excellent. Blood Cauldron, it's just a better cauldron, is the thing. And, like, cauldron is already really good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, a regular, a, a cauldron that does one health swing, fantastic. Upgrade. A cauldron that does two health swing, ridiculous. All right, so now we're upgraded, yep. so that's, um... Takes anything, which is right. nice. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. Blood Cauldron is two uses. Two uses, uses which is also pretty good. Is four damage, is four damage. Sure. Enchanted Shield is who gives a shit? It's uh, max four! Woo! Yeah! Woo! Alright, so we really want uh, some more payoffs here. Ah, Miracle. Oh god. Can you dice with six get We one? did really uh, good with that, didn't we? we? We generate a lot of dice with that. Especially because, like, upgraded, it's even better. Yeah. I don't remember exactly what, but... On even. even. Right, so you can put the four or the six in it. So we put that in three? I'm in four. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I think I'm gonna slap that, that on That seems really uh, good, yeah. Three. Mirror Cauldron is just a way better version of Hall of Mirrors, is the thing. Yes. Because you get a new dice. We definitely yep. had ones where we had the really good, the four, five, and the six, and we yep. did some nasty shit with that. All right. I really want to replace this. Wanna re I, I want this. another, very, like, uh, thing of damage. Another, another source of damage. Thing. Another source of mana and another source of... Uh, a source yeah. of mana, I yeah. should say, at this point. Any source of damage would be uh, excellent. Or just a non-mana source of damage, in which case, like, Sunbeam yeah. can become a secondary. Yes. Both would be reasonable. All right, um... Reroll one. Yes, reroll a five. Ah, that uh, Mirror Cauldron gives us an extra dice now. And we can uh, replace it, like put the Sunbeam over it. Yes, put the Sunbeam in there and then just do five damage on top of the extra dice we got. Burn, burn my dice. See if I care. <laughs> I can just throw that shit at you. Oh, well, that's a lot of useless shit. Um, uh -huh. alright, I think I'm gonna throw the six in the blood cauldron. Seems reasonable. That's nice. Uh, five. A one probably goes in one of the in that sunbeam. I think that's... I think we definitely grab a full, another blood Yeah, we definitely get another Blood Cauldron, at least. Um... Huh. I like it. So we could... This, get two Sunbeams out. I can even put a Sunbeam on there. Yeah. Put the four in it. Yeah. And then we just probably throw the burning dice at him. Yeah, I think so. It's two damage, it's respectable. Yeah. Yeah, it's like it's not the eight damage of magic missile, but even like a flat five damage with no conditions. It's still pretty fucking good. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and drain some health. Yep. Yeah, boy, yeah, we should burn. really just be throwing all of our ones into, like, the upgraded slot when we can kill with pokes, because yeah. that's, like, nutso. Yeah, so, um, burning dice do two damage instead of one. Yes. Uh, we don't want either of those. Grab the health, onward. All right. Um, that sounds, like, bad for the witch. That's really bad for the witch, yeah. Uh, with the Blood Cauldron, we can turn a dice into a different number. Mm -hmm. But the way we've set up... Uh... We do kind of want to get started on the first turn, especially with, like, the Mirror Cauldron. So we just go Chaos Round 2 to see if we can learn about another new rule? Hell no! yeah! Our 
favorite. Well, the run has been blessed by God. Oh, hey, it's oh we're, the same on, floor. we're on the same floor again. All right. <laughs> Mimic, hello. <laughs> he laughed. I heard him. Knock it off. Oh, go a five. That's nice. Um. Huh. Huh. All right. Well, I'm gonna put it on the unupgraded slot then. Fuck you. Yeah, hi, buddy. Your rule is ass. Uh, we can wear a cauldron. Not bad. Another. Sunbeam. Uh, Mimic World is fucking amazing. <laughs> Just incredible. Love it. I'm considering getting out a mirror cauldron. I think I'm gonna re-roll. Uh, but doesn't that remove the mirror cauldron? No, I was gonna put it on the upgrade slot. You don't have a four, though. Oh, shit! Right, it doesn't take twos. Oh, balls. I thought it was just even. Right, it's min four. Fuck, that was dumb. Alright. There we go! <laughs> We're fine! Hashtag blessed. Hashtag blessed. Alright. We're, we're it's fine. fine. It's fucking fine. It's Don't worry about it. Fucking calculated. Fine. <laughs> exactly as planned. No, nope, you can just double sunbeam. I'm gonna have to try and remember that Mirror Cauldron is min yes. four. Four and six are the numbers we want. It's my burn. Oh, the cowboy rule is so harsh. There's cowboy so rule is quite many. powerful. All right, uh, we should suck some health, and if we get a one, we suck even more health. Yes, yes, absolutely. Nope. All right. That's the other thing about blood cauldron. <gasps> you can do a lot of bullshit with it. All right, what's in the shop? Um, another flower pot. Magic uh, Jagger. Health. Um, honestly, I don't really care for either of these. Yep. Um. No. And this just isn't a very good mana. It's, it's not a very good cauldron, is really the thing. Like, I'm honestly probably just gonna... I might just buy this, because it's perfect heal. <laughs> uh, we do level up after this fight. Oh, yeah. We still don't have a six, no. Like, nothing's been worth it. We don't even want our four. Should we grab a heal? Um, potentially. Of course, we have no idea what that is. Yeah. Might as well. <laughs> Hi, Flower Pot. It really is just like, if it always gave mana, even if it was max four, I think it would be, well, probably broken. But like, it, it really is like, it does so little. <laughs> All right, um... No, oh, we can sunbeam. I don't want to grab out an infliction. That seems reasonable. We do at least level as long as we survive. Okay, that's not bad. Yep. We lose that. We only got one poison on us. So, they're double poison. Um... Yeah, they're not exactly building max of poison on us here. Yeah, mm -hmm. Ah, I got three. Um, we could haul a mirror. I definitely want to, yeah. I think it's like with a lot of blood cauldron, I might miss out the sunbeam. Mm -hmm. I might wear blood cauldron if it doesn't, it goes in the. If it's even yeah, if it's like you like lose cauldron. one damage if it does, if it isn't even, you know? Oh, got an even there anyway. Right, we get the dice, another dice from yes. the new miracle. Huh? Because it's yeah. nuts. So he's gonna double. He's gonna one. give us two yeah. poison. Woo! Two whole poison. Fuck me up, Woo. dude. Alright. 
God, we can even throw a six in Mirror Culture. <laughs> For funsies. We got two fives there. He should be dead at this point. Which I feel like, yes, we can almost certainly kill him. Probably one of the sixes, yeah, uh, in Mirror Cauldron to re-roll it. One, maybe? Uh, you can't. Oh, right. Um, <laughs> uh, I just go ahead and... Um... What? What? That's still a five. I mean, I, think, I don't think we need more. We only need... We actually only need two, because... Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, we have the Infliction as well. Yeah. Yep, we win. Two whole poison. Yeah. Nothing like a magic missile of the darkness. Yep. Yeah, that's kind of funny. If we can't get the poison on you, yep. like, I just can't get it. Ooh, uh, duplicate. I like duplicate. Many, many of dice. What do we need mana for if we just have many of dice? You know? And yeah, what if we just keep fun, doing five but... damage? Like. Sometimes doing 10 damage is nice, right, but if we have a billion dice... Four or six, or even two, but... Um, that's an interesting question. I feel like, what, what dice do you actually want to duplicate? It's probably fives, right? Mm-hmm. Um... And... Yeah, it almost certainly is, um... Duping fours and sixes is also nice for Mirror Cauldron. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Might be Infliction, as weird as that is. Makes Sunbeam like our only real source of damage other than Blood Cauldron, but even then, like, we- I was surprised we actually is. got use of Infliction in this, uh, right. run. So it might just be that twos make the duplicate run a lot more smoothly. Fuck putting something on six. <laughs> Who cares? Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Um. Put it on the six slot! I'm getting rid of it though, because. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. It's um... once again a uh, if you can build up enough mana kind of thing. Which is fine, but. We don't actually have a mana generator. Yep. Well, we got the Mirror we Cauldron. Mirror Cauldron. And we can summon in on there and then put the uh, four in the blood yeah. cauldron. Yeah, yep. Blood cauldron and then sunbeam regardless. <laughs> and so I would definitely like another damage thing. Yes. Like a really good damage thing. Like something is, something is to go on okay, four, basically. We definitely need more, yep. for sure. All right. We just have not been offered like any direct damage other than sunbeam, basically. Okay, I think I'll roll the six in here. That seems fine. The great thing about Mirror Cauldron is you're just re-rolling, you know? You get a bonus dice for all your future turns, but it's not even like you give up tempo. Alright. Roll Crystal Ball. Alright, so we have A5. I have a duplicate. Maybe end up used on that 5. We're gonna thorn ourselves a bunch, but you'll be dead, so it's fine. I mean, Crystal Ball again. Yeah, exactly. We can get an exactly. uh, achievement for doing it twice uh, <laughs> in, in one round. Yeah. Uh, just let me go ahead and. <laughs> we hit ourselves. We do five even have times. another duplicate uh, if, for another five if we want, and that would actually let us. Throw out another magic missile. That seems like the best use of our time. Solar beam! And then he's just dead next turn no matter what. Yep, we took a lot of damage. We took a bunch, so yes. We'll pick up that health. Switch. I think so, yeah. The witch doesn't tend to buy too much. Ouch. Yeah, a little bit harsh there. All right. There's no point draining because we actually take one yes, damage. Yes, we would take one damage from our drains hilariously. We did a double sunbeam run with the daffodil. Um, 
And it worked out fine, but yeah, Adapt is not amazing. Yeah. Like, I would say our our build is actually pretty close to being really good. We really just it need just to needs replace, a source of damage over that four. This or this if it's something. like a max four, you put it on the six, but either way. We just have not been offered any of that whole, like, set of spells. That sounds terrifying. That is utterly terrifying. It'll do nothing in some fights and then just absolutely Cornelius destroy us in others. would be, like, would just kill you. Yeah. Uh, on this rule. Oh, shit. Do we go? Chaos mode number three. All right, chaos mode number three. Especially considering enemies always roll a six, which that's would mean fine. that if they dump the six in. So, yeah, that's an enemy. The first, yeah, like these two are definitely enemies. Um, and I assume that's an enemy. True, at least it came after Sneezy. Cauldron. Dump a six in, because what the fuck else are we going to do with a six? That's another five, so that's nice. What are we throwing into the Blood Cauldron? You could always Mirror Cauldron a second time if you're feeling real feisty. It's probably the four. Yeah, I think I will Mirror Cauldron again, because I'm feeling a bit feisty. Um, okay, I might as well... Yep. <laughs> Then we just sunbeam twice. Once on that slot, once on upgraded. Yep. Now we have five dice, but all right. Froze us twice, but we got two, five dice. So, you know, two extra dice. Yeah, that's all right with me. Especially because we have blood cauldron on one. Go figure. Yeah. Dump everything into Sunbeam Futures. Yep. Oh. Uh, you can turn a one into another Blood Cauldron. Just to get one extra damage and heal. Yeah. I think we want to take all the healing we can get right now. Yeah, absolutely. much health he has. Ah, uh, whatever. We did it's flavor blast him. Either dead or he's not dead. That's all that matters. I don't I think, think we, we should be able to kill him. Even with all these ones, because we have a billion sunbeams. Spend that one, and then I think we just start blood cauldroning, probably in the upgrade slot. Oh. Yeah, sorry. That's all right. If he doesn't die, we crystal ball. <laughs> yeah. More! More! Oh. Well, actually, not everybody. Mm -hmm. uh, there yes. we go. Just had to get over the line. <laughs> yep. We did suck up a good amount of health there. That's definitely a uh, health. We don't level till we beat both of these. Yeah, so that'll be a fight and a, and a yes, check. Yes, and a so chest, so wanna... yeah, I think so. Oh, ah, it was an apple. Uh, well, that's fine. There you are! <laughs> there are loud bird! Oh, hey, good. buddy! Well, you fucking asshole. We are definitely gonna wanna just bury him in dice. I grab a duplicate, but I don't like either the duplicate options. So yes. I might throw these six. Yeah. Wow. Got worse. Ah, uh, wow, that got so much worse. Damn. Uh, I'm probably just gonna kind of grab the duplicate. Yep. Duplicate four and then throw three dice in. Oh. Do we want enchanted shield? No, we don't. Oh, we're getting silenced. He's not dodging our next attack. <laughs> not um. the greatest. 
Well, basically the only thing I can do is put like Sunbeam out. Yes, and I think that's kind of where we want to be, as sad as that is. We really need to get that mirror cauldron like out so that we can power through silence. That's kind of the yeah. only way we get this. And because we're about to get silenced again. Because he'll just keep doing that. Okay, we can get mirror cauldron out. Mm-hmm. I can also blood drain because I'm gonna, I'm gonna yes. end up putting one of these dice. Oh, in uh, oh, dodge. That's fine. I, I don't think it makes that much of a difference. All right. Uh, I think it's just five damage then. Yeah. Oh, I hate dodge. Yep. We're gonna get silenced every turn. We're, we're on this average. run is probably gonna end here. All right, well, we can finally duplicate. Um, Does that mean we can actually play Mirror Cauldron? Finally get another dice. Yeah. Yo, fuck your dodge, dude. I'm going around it. I put the uh, two in the... Yes. Like, at this point, we basically throw every six we oh. can into Mirror Cauldron, and that's... We do no damage, because yep. he's about to dodge. <laughs> um... Ah! Choo! Hate this guy. Yup. Alright, well, he didn't silence us for once. Ah, Mirror Cauldron minus loses it. Yes. Um... We're definitely crystalling. Yeah. Okay, um, so we could grab a new dice with a two, mm -hmm. or even a three. We could duplicate our six and get even more dice with Mirror Cauldron. Yes, that's essentially what I feel. I, I, I feel think like we like doing here. that, so if we dupe the six, we then can, like, duplicate twice. or Mirror Cauldron twice, and we get the dice back. We definitely hold on to that five. I think I might Blood Cauldron. Mm -hmm. Is that where I could use the Sunbeam here, put the Blood Cauldron here? Yeah, I kind of like doing that. Like, again, soak up as much health as possible to try to offset this fucker. All right, he dodged. But yeah, like, his silences won't matter as much if we just bury him in dice. And if we get a bunch of Blood Cauldrons, like, probably even Blood Cauldron Plus again twice, he doesn't actually have that much damage output. So if we keep draining, like, if we drain four health from him this turn, uh, we actually end up getting some really nice shit. Like, he, he actually can't kill us if we have enough dice. All I could do is get another Mirror Cauldron out. It would have to be um, on the upgrade slot, right? To get us yeah, an extra dice, but yeah, that's probably and then fine. I overwrite yeah, it with the five. overwrite it with another Sunbeam, and now we're up to seven dice. <laughs> you want to know how to right. beat Loud Bird? Be even more obnoxious. All right, here's the silence. So hopefully that's not too bad. Hopefully we don't need to. Well, we probably do need to, but... We have a lot of dice now. Yes, we have so many dice that, like, the silence actually doesn't matter that much. Alright. Um... We also want to use these ones really aggressively to heal up so that he yes. doesn't do as much to us. I throw the... And he doesn't have a dodge. Four nice. in here. Mm -hmm. uh, God, then I need to... i probably get rid of a five and a one to keep fives and ones. What are we breaking the silence with? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. I'm doing it with a five and a one, so that yeah. we have two fives and two yeah. ones left, and then we can like generate this four a bunch. Yep. Probably need to. I might just have to give away one of these. That or one of the ones. I do kind of like the ones for the blood cauldron. Yeah. So you give away one of the fives. I think so. Because, like, if we do four Blood Cauldrons here, then he only did one damage to us last turn, and that's kind of huge. Oh my 
got a six, I apologize. Yes. I, I should have put it in there. That's all right. I was. I also was oh, not paying attention. Oh, we're silenced again. We're not taking much damage though. He is diving. He is uh, dodging. Not much me aware of that. Albert is definitely an and asshole. motherfucker. Well, we can use duplicate minus now that we've got five hundred sixes. You say seven dice is enough, but what if it's not? What if it just isn't? All right. Um. So he has dodge one. Make, important to make sure we remember yes, that. Yes. Yes. Probably want to throw something in the blood cauldron. The one used one. At some point. We have those ones, so we can actually heal from this turn. That just be a six. Mm-hmm. And I think the mm, three, because I like we're gonna get another mirror cauldron out. That would really be the question if we wanted to grab another mirror cauldron. I think we're probably getting. Oh, it would be quite nice. Uh, Yeah, what are the sixes doing right now? Not really anything, they're just up there. I need somewhere to put them. Mm -hmm. Do we want to dupe anything is also the question. Not currently. No. We might want to, but... But we need our dice to do something. I think we want to keep the ones above all else just to heal up. The only way that we end up surviving this is if we suck enough health out of him that this fight being seven years long doesn't kill us. Fuck it. It's a shame you got Mirror Cauldron minus there, but it's life sometimes. Anything grabbing out the dude? Alright, um. We could just keep Blood Cauldron in. Like, what, what if I just kept stabbing this man? That's an right. interesting question. If we do the Sunbeam here, or if we do even more Blood Cauldrons. I think I'm gonna do the Sunbeam. He's got to be getting close to oh, death. Oh, right. good. <laughs> yeah, so we actually all ended right. up healing that turn, which is nice. All right, all right. This is a uh, oh, health. Okay. Oh. Oh. Well, that's fine, actually. That's that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Because we heal we, after we this anyway. After or, this. Like, we, there's nothing I left on the floor. I expected one of those to be a shop. Right? I was certain we'd have a shop there. <laughs> all right, then. Okay. Well, we can mirror cauldron. Start your day off right. A lot of blood cauldron plus over another mirror cauldron. Then just fucking dump it. Take that. Ooh, ouch. You're taking much damage. We oh. do get crystal ball. Crystal ball, here we go. That's a six, so that can go into that free mirror cauldron. We even have a burning three that can go into that if we want. And a non-burning three. Alright. Um, ah, there's a lot going on here. We have no fives, so we're probably gonna be dumping a bunch of stuff into blood cauldrons to heal up. Yeah. Pocket. I don't know if we want to do every blood cauldron here. Um, but at the same time, it's not the worst strategy. No. I would very much like a five. I know. How many dice can we roll that are not five? <laughs> um, a lot, I guess. Apparently. Yo, fuck fives, actually. Yeah, pretty much. Hey. Okay, that is one five. Do we want to duplicate that? And then we throw a three in, and then we uh, ah, there's sunbeam. The fives. Finally, five party. So we did actually just gain back a ton of the health that we got damaged for there. Yeah, we got Blood like Cauldron five health back. Is Blood Cauldron's good. fucking nuts. This run would be over if we didn't have Blood oh, Cauldron. Yeah. Loudbird would have killed us. Or. Fireman would have killed us after Loudbird left us at like three health. Fuck. 
Uh -huh. Cats can have little of dice. Sure can. Well, oh god, that's... we found the five party. Yep. We just we just kinda win. I didn't need to do it. Oh well. That's life. There was no way of knowing. Yep. I didn't want to waste. We're building the, our uh... crystal balls quite a lot, like quite quickly anyway, so. Dice. I think it's dice. dice. Like, we're actually doing pretty okay with this build dice. overall. Yep, I want dice. Uh, do four damage at, at start, start of the turn, turn do three. three. Oh, that seems really good. Like, that's definitely worth taking oh, over. Oh, so that just does yeah, damage three da if it's in, I think turn. it's if it's in your slots, do Holy three damage shit. every turn. Um, yeah. Do that's that over really four interesting. Four or six? Probably four. Like, I don't think it matters too, too much. That's a weird one. <laughs> yeah, because you can dupe fours as easily as sixes. So. Yeah, it would really just be that, like, sixes we can put in Mirror Cauldron without putting it in an upgrade slot. That's, like, the only way that a four is better. But I think that's a reason to put it in a four. Holy shit. That, that might just wanna. That good. might just want to sit in a, uh... That really just do four damage to the enemy. That seems like it. That turn. sounds like a thing. That seems really strong. <laughs> All right, we just we want another upgraded slot to just. I, yeah, you know. In. I'm glad we took the dice though. Like that'll yeah, that'll yeah, make yeah, that yeah. even better. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But yeah, like what if you just cast a free infliction every turn? Ugh. Boy, um, howdy. So do we just go a four chaos run? <laughs> God, although on the witch, there's only one. True, we one. only we would lose, lose access to dice. our blood cauldron. You basically lose eight dice because yeah. we then have to on. That yeah, that actually that. might be worth taking, like relative to a lot of other things. Yeah, like on our first turn, and it's only on your first turn that everything's shocked. Mm -hmm. That might actually be basically, less we, bad than a random. Basically, we have three dice. It, it takes yeah. away a dice. Yes, on our it takes turn. away a dice, and we just leveled into a dice. And like, the bro, the build is actually running pretty smoothly, all things considered. Oh, jeez. Wow, I don't uh, think I've seen this layout before, but I think it's these two are monsters leading to the hideout, and then these two are blocking things and our monsters. One of these will be a shop, one will be a chest, these two will be like apples out there, I feel like, but no way to actually know that! <laughs> Chests are pretty funny. I love Shit. this. Um, where do I go? God, um... I mean, the, we... I would say, based on how many of these types of floors we've seen, we can be reasonably sure that these two are hell. Me, yeah! Not 100% hey, certain, you. one could easily be a chest, and I could also time. be totally wrong. But, so do we go with these two? So it Basically, might just be. Um, yeah, like we're giving so up one thing no if, matter what. if we what. don't go up to these two, we give up two items. Yes, two of whatever that is where it's one with either of those. Thank you so much for the bits. Thank you so much, Fruit Salad Kung Fu. All right. Well. Everybody, hero time! <laughs> Get upon Ricky Go! All right. So we can also choose like the best, like the, the dice we give the shit. Yes, the least of a shit about. Um, alright. Please don't leave, I need your advice. What, what do I, do I put one of the twos? Hmm. Probably, I mean, you could dupe a six to get a mirror cauldron going eventually. Um, not quite. Alright, so it's the six that goes. Five? Mm. Even the two? Well, I need the two for the duplicate if we do want to duplicate. Yeah, I guess that's the question. If we do want to trade a two for one of these dice. Well, I could duplicate a five and, you know, I could put the duplicate out, dupe one of these and put, put mm -hmm. the duplicate in there. Mm -hmm. Then we have a six and a five for whatever comes out. Yeah. I like that. And a duplicate on our on board. board, which is really the big bonus that you get. Ah. Uh. Four. Ah, hello, Enchanted Bolt. All right. So that's um, nice. Wait, Enchanted Bolt, did I have a... It's plus one damage to each of the effects on upgrade. Yeah, 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 but um, did, what was its um, condition? Even, I believe. Is it even? Yes, it's even. It's another magic missile like. All right. What if we just had Poison 4 on the memory uh, turn? I think I just grabbed the Sunbeam I think now. so, Sunbeam in that slot there, like... 
We kind of like that Enchanted Bolt ending the turn in our upgrade slot. No curse. Okay, only one attack. Yeah, that actually turned out pretty well. Yeah, that just does four damage a turn. Go figure. Fuck. As All long right. as you end with that, which we can do again if we want. Yeah. What do we do? Yeah, I don't think we get rid of this, so... We um... can even get rid of it and then replace it at the end of the turn with another Enchanted Bolt. Because, of course, it is a magic missile on its oh, own. Oh, yeah, absolutely, absolutely. We definitely uh, do... Yeah, it's really I as long as we end the, the turn with I'm it I'm duping in. the four, mm -hmm. um, and I think I'm going to re-roll a five. Mm -hmm. God, we can even pull out a second Enchanted Bolt on another slot and do seven damage at the start of a turn if we want. Yeah. And that might be a way to go. Hmm. And what can we do with this? Um... Five's a little awkward. You can always, like, play one Enchanted Bolt, pay the five in, and throw... I guess everything else is even, so you don't really care. That might have, I, I like that, actually. I feel like we're gonna have a five left over. Yeah. Like, one of these goes in that, one of these goes in there, and then we draw out the other enchanted bolt in here, put a six in it. Yeah. And then the five just gets thrown, maybe? Potentially. Um, like, I can duplicate, I don't know how much... I don't think that's particularly useful here. Mm -hmm. I think we still end up with an extra bit. Yeah, turning the two into something doesn't really change the... No, no. Because that's, of course, how you have to think of the duplicate when it's not already in your spell slot. Okay, yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do. I think we're gonna do... Bring out another enchanted bolt. Which I think is just a bear sunbeam at this point. Quite possibly. Um, when it's extra damage, I'm, I'm just gonna fling that dice. Alright. Yeah, like, it doesn't chain in the same way, just because it does less damage, but... Seven damage that turn. I wasn't paying enough attention. Um, I can't keep track. I actually can't. Oh. Yeah, I can't imagine it wouldn't. I didn't see it do the seven damage though. Hmm. Yeah, apparently it did seven damage according to chat. A minus four and a minus three popped ah, up. Ah, did it. And that's nuts. Cause yeah, <laughs> we want that out instead of like out any uh like even over Sunbeam for sure. Oh yeah, you wanna end every turn with like as many enchanted bolts as won't screw you over next time. Yep. Hello, singer. Okay, so we can mirror cauldron. Imagine what we would want with more sixes. I think we can just do uh aperture. <laughs> Seems reasonable. Might even want to write one over mirror cauldron. Because we really do like writing over that uh sunbeam right. plus. 33. 
too weakened. The weakened will definitely slow mm, us down a bit. This is rough. Yep. We do have fours for enchanted bolts. Yes, we sure do. I probably drain, like, we roll one of these three. Yes, you do also have, like, you can, ah, that's nice. That's nice. I was gonna say you can use the dupli two for a duplicate or uh, something as well, for like another four as well. Um, I can put, um, I can use this sunbeam mm -hmm. and then put two enchanted bolts out. Mm -hmm. And then probably just fling the three. Yeah, I think that's probably where we end up most yeah. damage. God, do nine damage and then also do seven damage. We're gonna take 12 damage though. Yes. <laughs> you don't say. We didn't actually get the second sad verse, so I guess there's that. Let's really hope these are apples. Alright. There are three in here. Crystal ball. I, don't, I want to hold that for the next fight. Mm -hmm. I want to assume if we mm -hmm. can. You did the 33 uh, before the last turn. Yeah, so we did uh, like 15, like 16, 17. Yeah, we did a. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and just play. For six in here. Yeah. Yep. There we go. Okay. We also did seven damage with the uh, yes. enchanted bolts out. She did a lot of damage. To oh, us. yeah. I was right. This is probably the shop, I think. Yes, that's probably where we want to That's usually next. how this floor is laid out. We'll see. Wickerman, hello. Alright, um... Well, we can Blood Cauldron a lot, which yeah, is good. Yeah, I'm gonna just put it in here. Um... You roll one of the fives? I don't know if we want two Sunbeams out. Yeah, I think re-rolling that five is fine, and we can kind of just keep re-rolling it with all these ones as much as we want. That's good. To That's me. good. We want to hold on to that four now. We want to end the turn with Enchanted Bolt in the slot. Okay. Dang. We could grab the Blood Cauldron and start rerolling one of the ones. Yes, I think that's what I want to do. We really want to, like, see a three at some point, ideally. Um, I can dupe a four. could dupe a four, yeah, to get two. Unless, like, one of these becomes even, yeah. we're not going to get to use two, but we can put two out, yes. and that will do extra damage to him, so I'm okay with that. Yes. Uh, um, would you gonna... want to throw the five in, because then we'll get another... We get two extra rolls, basically. Nice. Okay, that's good. Uh, let me just get, um... Let me just get two, two of these out. And throw the one. And throw the one at him, yeah. It's incredible how we didn't get Mirror Cauldron there. Like, we didn't roll a single three in all of those rolls nope. we did. 30 health. And he's also about to take seven damage. Okay, he's getting two back. Is it 25, 25 health? Yeah, yeah, there it goes. Alright, um... Oh, we have a bunch of sixes. Um... I'm gonna do that. So I can do the two sixes in here. I can re-roll one of the Probably sixes. Probably one of the sixes. And yeah, and then the see what happens. Yeah. Perfect. Oh, that's really good, because now we can throw the one in um, Blood Cauldron and re-roll the six twice. Well, yeah, but then we might not be able to use Enchanted Bolt again. We would have, I think, like a 75% chance of being able to use Enchanted Bolt again. I mean, that's... we've done that, though. We've rolled two odds in a row. Yeah, so I'm just a... thinking that the two health is pretty, pretty strong I argument don't... for it. No, I think I would rather... Uh... Yeah, but I think I'd rather guarantee we get the damage in. Um, like, I think it's two less damage with the two Blood Cauldrons uh, and a Throne Dice. Yeah, okay. And if we get it on the first one, we don't even have to do the second reroll. Like, 
I'm perfectly happy just cheating him out of one extra damage. Especially with how okay, dirty this is. He's has been not doing getting us. me with her staff. It's yes, good. which is we're, good. We're gonna kill him this turn. Yes. Like, guaranteed. It's gonna take seven damage over there. He's probably pretty close to dead. I think Blood Cauldron. Yeah. There we go. I was gonna say, like, he had taken 14 damage across turns and he was at 25, like, when his health went away. That was a shop. All right, um, even even do damage. Well, that's basically chainsaw without the double. Mm -hmm. which is not then, bad. Inferno, Inferno is damage, flat, which but... is nice, because of course we like our evens. I definitely think we're just gonna go ahead and buy this. Buy health, and then we can decide if we want Inferno like, or after not. After the next fight, we can decide. We probably, we possibly I do. I think we kind of do like it. Like, oh, maybe you've over, yeah, over Northern Lights. Northern Lights, we haven't, like, picked out once. No. Um, all right, so we got the health. All right, yes. last fight. Yes, it is. Paper Knight! Paper Knight. Inferno okay, would have like been good this, against actually. Paper Knight. Go figure. Um, but yeah, Having Paper Knight health is also good against Paper just Knight. can't actually kill us. I mean, Man, we actually I mean, end Paper up doing Knight Paper Knight can, last. Can kill us eventually, but it does 9, 16, 21, With the vampire 24, effect, we actually one, can kind of just... One, one, one. Yeah, yeah, actually. We can with, outlast um, Paper Knight completely. Yeah. Absolutely not. Yeah, so I think I'm going to get the Mirror Cauldron. Yes, absolutely. Again, more dice just allows us to Blood Cauldron for longer. Yeah, Solstice and a mana build, absolutely. Triple damage is a lot. Solstice yep. seems really good. I would really love to do a mana build at some point. The game just hasn't, hasn't let us yet. No, this gave us a Blood Cauldron instead. That's the build. And you know, mind. Blood Cauldron's fucking seen us through thick and thin here. You say not enough mana. I say no mana. Uh. All right, 42. Uh. Lock one and we crystal ball. Uh. Renet two. You can mirror cauldron in the uh whatchamacallit, uh plus slot if we want another another dice. I'm I not sure mind. how important no, it is. I'm gonna take the fours, because the fours are where we are at. Um I'm probably gonna go ahead and just yeah, I don't think we want another mirror cauldron because we blood. Yep. Nice! So we actually get the mirror cauldron. Beautiful. Um, Nothing like a free mirror cauldron for the soul. Um Kind of need another even. Uh, we actually, well, actually, I think we set this off with like a B. Yeah. I think I'm going to Blood Cauldron. Yep. This one. A ton of incidental health is really good for us here. And then I'm going Sunbeam sun and beam Smash, and then... and then we are going to set up our usual strategy. I'm trying to... Enchanted Bolt is really good. Holy shit. Just like it's, it, it does an extra damage just yep. for being in your. Like, it's it's like you can't chain it to do 50 magic missiles in a turn, or at least it's not as good when you do that. But just on its own, especially with us having Blood Cauldron just making us so fucking survivable, yep. it's really, really good. of the squid rule is just like upgrade yeah what if we did even One, more like we don't really want a prep slot because it'll get shocked yeah um two yes. now wow yeah now second we have, slot is literally useless now we have two upgrade, so eight damage from bolt. uh yeah, enchanted like, bolts and they're just, I mean, magic, just, I mean, just magic missiles on their own now. yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. all right what's in there oh, ah hell. it was an apple makes sense yeah um and we probably just buy inferno because what the fuck else are we doing with our gold 
And what does Inferno upgrade to? Two dice, I believe. Yeah, just burns two dice. But it is just a dump, um, which is really nice, potentially. All right, onwards. And in an unupgraded slot, it's perfectly good. Oh, Audrey. Audrey. I haven't seen her in a while. What are we going to do if we beat the bonus rounds this fast? I have no idea. Fuck. Uh, all right. <laughs> it's just a chest. Time to die. Time to die. Whose could it be? It would be really funny if it just showed a chest in the uh, introduction. Oh, that mimic rule is amazing. One day. One day. Oh, I already like that. Um, we could just have two enchanted bolts out even if we don't do anything else with them. Um, yep. You can even unshock and re-roll one of your odds just to see if it turns into an even. Yeah, I think I will. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Do I just want to do 13 damage to Fuck her? Fuck it. Yeah, yeah, I do. Most amongst us would not. All right, so yeah, she is head headbutt and earthquake. A lot of damage. We can throw and do six damage. Ouch. She did take the fours there. Yeah. All right, crystal ball. Yes. Um, um, so we can mirror cauldron if we want with a three and a four. Um, we have the one four here. And we can't re-roll anything, which is a shame. Yes. We can dupe a four to get another enchanted bolt. Mm -hmm. um, not that we can do much with it, actually. Yeah. Um, I think we're gonna be using this five. We do Maybe have the two five. twos, yeah. Like I'm the twos can turn If I fours. use a two in a, in a duplicate to get an extra four, yeah, we can use it one doesn't of the really change anything. But I think I think it's dupe the fives, and mm -hmm. then in the upgraded mm -hmm. slots they'll do anything. So probably just um. But it's like doing mirror cauldron for an extra dice, which does stop me from getting the enchanted bolt. could duplicate the four to get an enchanted bolt and a mirror cauldron. Yeah, I think that's what I ended up doing. And that might be good. That might even open us some options here. We get something nice. Okay, that's good, that's good. All right. I think I... Five over this slot. Mm hmm. Put a three in it. Yeah. I think we drain one. Drain one with the, the, with the three that we have, yeah. The other three that we have. It's better than throwing. Can you just go over this? Yes, because we'll do the four damage, the, the four damage uh, twice. Drain one health, all right. Like, God, starting every turn with eight damage is pretty nice. Ooh. We're taking a beating, that's for sure. Ouch. We're either gonna win this or we're gonna die. We'll see. Okay. We'll oh, we can eight. dupe the six, which would then let us enchanted bolt twice. Yeah, which we do. Yes, we also actually have a bunch of twos for those fours. We have a one that can go into, like, another blood cauldron. Um... We could get a Blood Cauldron out and re-roll this three a bunch. Yes. Um, we can even do it with, like, the Blood Cauldron we currently have as well for one extra pip. And frankly, I think that just getting enough health to get across the line is probably the way to go here. <laughs> and she can do... 18, 18 damage, damage in a turn. Yeah, so and I, I do think... think if we live to next turn, we just win. Okay, there, so we get another Blood Cauldron yes. out. We get 20 health. That'll yes. take us over in the uh, line. Cause like, we are doing so much to her. It is just that she has so much health. Oh, this is fun. All right, so I get out the two enchanted bolts yep. over here. Yep, back over here. Just keep pumping out that damage. This is a new and really weird way to use a uh, magic missile, I gotta say. She's not getting the. Oh, she is getting the earthquake. Okay. Mm -hmm. Makes sense. Um, okay. 
And we can duplicate six. Yeah, we didn't get crystal ball, which is unfortunate, but I think we should hopefully manage this. Oh boy. Who knows how much health she has. That's the big right. question. I think I rerolled a five. Yeah. Um, a cauldron. Reason not to. <laughs> yeah, no reason not to. Alright. Oh, yes! yes! Blind health has made everything very funny. All right. We, we are, are persistent. persistent. Never stopped. Mm -hmm. uh, setting the wheel, spinning. Oh, do we see what's behind the bonus door? Did you see what's behind bonus door? <laughs> Blood Cauldron won that run. Blood Cauldron, There were yeah. several places yeah. we should have died yes. there. Yes, yes. Like, getting oh, the health like, back is so ridiculous. Um, yeah, all six, so 13 times was all six bonus rounds. Go figure. Alright. Yeah, we're getting pancakes. bosses now. Sorry, not sorry. Things you couldn't live without. The shadow, the storm, the ashes, the wind, the cold, and the creeping fog. Go for well, it. it has a lot of shadows. Storms, <laughs> creeping fog, ashes, wind, and cold. It's true. I'm way at the start, way at the end. There we go. Rat King! The Rat King knows no fear! Shall I pet other much smaller rats? Yes! <laughs> Time to find new rats to conquer! Hmm. Hello, Lady Luck, huh? Alright, well, there's a car. Finally. Seems fabulous. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> oh no. <laughs> sure? <laughs> she is pretty large. We have. Yeah? Yeah? She is a sheep. And the game isn't fair. Poison, huh? Uh, um, hmm. I'm torn between like the warrior because you know, the goodest lad, or uh, the jester because the jester's fucking jester fun for shit. comedy purposes. The jester's fun as shit. You know? Yeah, they are pretty great. Shall we just go jester? Fuck it, let's do it. The jester is fun as shit. Got me jester. Chat wants jester too. Gonna get you all in here, the frog, baby squid, and everyone! Yeah, we are! Hell yeah! Alright, fight away to rescue everyone and skip dungeons. Just just knocked out, it's game over. Game over, yeah! Ah! Ah, party! Party! Oh my! Well, this is gonna get well, interesting. Space Marine? Come on, Space Marine! Against all odds, roll four even dice. Mm -hmm. Just as the saving animals route. <laughs> nice. You mean prison set a minion train? You're here, I'm always up for another fight. Bazam. Switch fighter once per turn. Bazam. Oh my. Okay, so. That is Victor Lee. Yep. Oh. <laughs> Amazing! Congratulations! Ah, no. no, come join me! Yeah, 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 you can come! Uh-oh! Come on! Welcome! 
Hell yeah, Space Marine! Oh my, this is gonna get weird. <laughs> yes it is. Alright. Hot head. It doesn't look like we level, which is interesting. No, <laughs> no cool uh, opponent for you. So yeah, I don't think we want to switch him. <laughs> We don't want to switch to the, uh, the boy. I mean, I suppose it's always an option, but... Considering that he needs to get 20, I, I assume he's got his exact same cards. gonna be a, um, I don't want Majestic to die, kind of a... Yeah. Meat shield. Yeah. You can swap, I suppose, um, and dump that five in and do anything else with it. Yeah, so you can pick. We're also doing some science on it. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Okay. <laughs> Amazing. All right, let me, uh, switch back. Yeah, we can reroll this as much as we want. We win! Alright, he trying to going in. I wish I could see what their equipment was in their, like, party. Yeah, it would be nice. Okay, look. Yeah, come with yeah. me! I assume come it's the same me. thing that they have come in the fight against me. you, so he's gonna have the one even. Yeah, mm -hmm. Um, so switching to him at the end can be good to just fucking blast him. God, you also, I assume, have to know... Yeah, you have to know... Like, they... what their weaknesses and stuff are. Oh, I just gonna get wacky. I don't, I don't even need the health! Oh. Ah. Okay, you select a teammate to uh, heal. Got it. I was wondering okay. about that. Onwards! Alright, well, uh, quit it. Does sound good. And we're getting the alchemist, we might be able to turn into bear. <laughs> so we can potentially throw that six into the Bernie guy. Yeah, I think we do. Do we put the four in here? Probably, because we don't. We, I don't think we'll use that dice otherwise. We'll see if he has two, but you know, again, learning. Yeah, so I think they'll just have whatever they have. So let's see what he's moves are. I guess we can do that either way. Usual pirate set. Okay. Yeah, pirate's pretty Pirate's good. actually nice as a dice dump, yeah. Yeah, we have to see if we want to switch. Yeah, we can't use it with him, so it's mostly if we want him to take the burn damage. Yeah, I think I probably do. Mm -hmm. Can limit break if we want to use his. Yes. We'd also be able to dump a lot into the Space Marine. Yeah. I think we switched to Space Marine, huh? Mm hmm All right. We only get one switch, but it's, yeah, like, given all this. We blast! And he can't actually unburn his yep. dice, so that's <laughs> nice. Yeah, he only gets one die to use. Flop over to Hothead. I guess it doesn't really matter which of the two, because Ugly Ball also does the damage. I want to see if we add on Hothead what happens. Yeah, I am curious about that too. If he starts at the front of the party or if it's always Jester. I think it might just be Jester. Alright, um, I think I might hold off on the health for see now. See what happens at the I'm not sure I want to heal. I kind of feel like we want to heat keep all our health yeah, for Jester. Yeah, because... ideally. Uh, he dies, we lose. Or at least our good party members, because I feel yeah. like a lot of the times we can swap away from Jester at the end of turn to save ourselves, which is nice. Yep, alright, juggling ball. Juggling ball. Um, Pirate can reuse the hook on four, right? Mm -hmm. So we can do eight damage with the Pirate right now if we want. Oh, look at that Pirate!
Oh no, our dice is falling. No. Oh no. no. Um, so that six is good for Hothead uh, to finish the turn on. Can we just inflict two burns on him? Uh, yeah, that and then one with Hothead. Well, like I'm saying, like yeah. I, I do, yeah. I, I put in here and then push the Hothead, who might die. Um, yeah. I mean, like. He's a hero. Yeah, he is. Might die. He's dead. That's fine. Let's see what happens when they die as well. Okay, we can pick our next Pokemon. That's good. And I assume they're just dead. They just leave. Presumably, yes. I'm so happy everyone gets back sprites. That's so great. <laughs> When are we leaving? Yeah, when are we leaving? Come with us! You can leave too! Yeah! yeah. Baby! Baby! baby he's, he's precious! Baby Squid, he's precious lad. Which means we're gonna get him killed. Of course. Yeah, so we might as well take that health because it, it goes away. Yes, we don't get it otherwise. That was an argument for not killing off Hothead, but. Yup. All right, well, it's handy, man. Right, There's shop. a shop. Wonder what shops will have. Anyone good. Yeah, he'll be fantastic. Yes. Um. Maybe Squid would be able to do 10 damage with that. Yeah. I have to try and keep... not get baby squid killed. No, I mean like remember. Ah, uh, yes, remember what have. everyone there's, can do. Yes, it's gonna get more and more. Mm. Probably do your headbutt. Headbutt, swap the jester, get those uh, rolls in. <laughs> Nailed it. On in we go. Yep, at least now a six does do five damage. Other thing shocked. I think Pirate should be able to kill him now. No, we win with Jester. Oh, yeah, Jester can do it as well. Yeah, we want an and. Yeah, an and. You do have so many ands. Yeah, he's gonna All be right. real nice. We're definitely gonna try to save the seal for Jester yeah. after the uh, fight. Oh, hello. Yeah, hi. What a fun group you oh, are. Oh, something for us on the house. Yeah, yeah. I was wondering. I know that you don't. You should actually yeah. have to say, yeah, maybe. I like the cut of your jib, Yolanda. I'll teach Lady Luck a lesson. All right, so yeah, I think we just keep the health mm -hmm. and then... Uh... Yeah, it's interesting. Like, you don't actually have to keep fighting everybody, but getting more party members seems really good. All right, I don't believe we have anyone who does uh, ice. We'll probably switch to Handyman, because he can even dump all of his dice in if we against all odds. Yes, I'll see. Like, we might get some stuff for Juggling Ball, yeah. um, which would be good, you know? Yep. <laughs> yeah, we can wind up Fist um, as well. I don't think we can use all of our dice, even with Handyman. Yeah. Or rather, that's better than a pea shooter is probably the better way to put that. Yeah, should we put the five and the two in here? I think so. <laughs> the fact that you only get one swap each turn is kind of nuts. Two fireballs. Yes, he is quite strong. With evens. Alright. Shock isn't amazing against him. Mm hmm. Yeah, he can just unshock with the uh, odd. 
Yep. Bunch of damage there. Still want a hammer here and then swap to Jester, or...? I feel like, yeah, I think the Jester could probably win. Win with win. these dice, yeah. That or like pirate. Pirate can't win. Jester might can be win, one. but only if he rolls high enough with both. Yeah. Of them. Like a seven with both of these, which like I think is over a 50-50 chance. I should have taken the burn damage on the uh, um, handyman and then healed him. Mm -hmm. Oh, we win. Nice. All right, good because we can heal him now. Yeah. Pirate win. I think Cannon is five damage, isn't it? Like, I've been a three and two and five. And it's six. The snowman, you can message for me. Fuck yeah, you! Yeah, come with me! Come with me, Fireman! We have all the fire damage now. Alright, let's heal up Jester. Yep. We will definitely want to heal up Handyman when we get the chance, but. I mean, um, yeah, but Jester's far more yes. important. Making sure Jester's topped off is the big thing. But I think our next apple should probably go to Handyman just because he's quite strong. For that six. Again, I feel like only if the Jester's, like, not damaged. All right, well, it's Wicker Man. Yep. We have a shit ton of fire damage. Oh, God. All right, we have so much fire damage. Okay. Um. So, yeah, the, the, the two even fireballs. Yes. I feel like we just, yeah, we re-roll We try to get some big. Re-roll the one. There we there go. We go. All right, Fireman. Come on, do you love getting his ass beat? All right. Okay, he's got 16 health. Oh, yeah. Well, we can roll a bunch of evens. I feel like we just go ahead and do that. All right. And then he dies. And then he dies. We probably didn't need to. We could like switch to someone probably. else. Probably. But... Fuck it. All right. Join us, Wicker Man. All right. Hell yeah. Take this. Extra dice. More. Yes. That's true, we're gonna just have it going downhill lately. Absolutely shake things up. Alright, so... I think I'll take on the Singer. Mostly if we want to heal one of our minions, since there are two health here. Um, it would either be the Handyman or the Fireman, both mm. of which are fairly good. I think Fireman might even be better, just because he's got 12 damage potential. Interesting question, though. I feel like she can only do, I mean, apart from the 12 damage, which is a lot of shit, um, she's got, what, 8 damage a turn? Yeah. I feel like she can shit out damage, so I'm a little worried about, um, Esther. Anyone you put out, yeah. Yeah. Fuck it, I'm gonna attack her and then I'm gonna figure out from there. All right. Oh, we don't have any evens, so mm -hmm. that's uh, not ideal. Fuck evens. All right, um... So we can space marine if we want here. Um, For 10 damage, that might be the most damage. damage we could manage. Because we do end up on Space Marine next turn, you can't do very much. I guess it comes down to who you'd want to take the first hit of this as well. I'm trying to remember who we have um, as well, and mm -hmm. like who can actually do damage with the well, fives. Yeah. Handyman could do it once, well see that he would die. Uh, baby Squid we'll can't one. do any. Yeah, can only do six damage with this. And Blind Singer's Dice. Um, Fireman doesn't do anything. Pirate 
would be able to do five damage and then two burn. And it might well just be um, Space Marine. Yeah, honestly. there's also a chance Space Marine fucking chunks it, although I think the second turn is the one where she'll be able to use her weakened ability. Yes, it absolutely is. Yeah. yeah, and then Wicker Man would be the other one, um, which wouldn't actually be the worst. Ooh, Wicker Man. Would he would be able six, to do six and plus the... eight and the burn. Yeah, eight and the burn. That might actually be good here, too, yeah. I think that's actually, that's more damage than Space Marine. Yeah. So I think, I think we can win. Nine damage and burn the two dice. That's good damage. I like yep. that. Yeah. And again, if he dies, it's not the worst thing in the world. Well, he can't. He's not really gonna die. It's the right. high note. Yes. I, I just mean like the damage he's taking isn't. We don't worry about that too much. Alright, um... So, yeah. Um, we can switch to the Jaxter take all that damage. Yeah, or... High Note is actually, like, not a huge chance it's it comes probably, out next yeah, turn, no, so we might yeah, actually be right. able to fit the Jester in. And even if he does take the damage, we do have the two apples available. Yeah, we don't really have anything Yeah, to exactly. Do we don't really have anything we want to do with him with those two weekends. other sassers, please. We do have against all odds. Um, Which I might use on the odds we can get a... Uh, hoping for some twos. Although, um, I think with the, the 12 damage here and 5 damage, we actually win? Yes, I think with, so. Um, yeah, with, uh, face, the five yes, line. you're right. That's, a, that's exactly lethal. <laughs> Yeehaw! I think we give one heal to Jester and one heal to Handyman here. I think so. Singer is an interesting one. Yeah, you can one. come because you're you're pretty Low stuff good. is really like the, yeah, anything yeah, under yeah. four is really good mm -hmm. for her. You gonna bring that piano with you? You gonna Vanessa Carlton here? Yeah, I think healing up Handyman is quite good because getting in a shock on the enemy just helps lower the damage output. All right. Going on to floor five. Uh oh! Uh -oh. Andre just chilling. There are three apples here, and then it's Lady Luck. Yeah, Winkin is fantastic here, yeah. Yes. For sure. Do we want it to add a boss to our party? Yeah, that seems like fun. Um, do we take her on first? Probably! Fuck it, let's go for it. We do at least start with against all odds. Ooh, nice, two sixes. Um, yeah, we can probably use high note even. Oh yeah, we definitely. Depending can use on high if note. we want to have Singer take a bunch of damage, she's gonna be really good. I feel like Singer has enough health. Um, yeah, take at least one punch. Here I um, I'm gonna reroll it. Reroll one of the ones. I think one of the ones. The two and the three, we want to go into Audrey's regular attacks as well, or uh, Singer's regular so attacks as well. So twenty she needs, right? I believe so. Yeah. All right, so we can actually do wind up first as well. Yeah. Here. I move all these dice down before I uh, <laughs> I switch just in case like shenanigans happen again. Yes. All so right. yeah, you can even put the four and the three in, right, for Singer. Yeah. Um, yes, I should be able to go ahead and put all these. Yes, uh, we'll make sure we get our math right. <laughs> and then we yeah. spend the rest on sad verse. Alright, that's good, but Lincoln's will. Trake would be pretty funny. 
I think you need to get the boss and also like sacrifice some of your uh, weaker yes, ones. Yes, well. that seems extremely worth it, especially because you only get one sieve, one like weak per turn or uh, swap, yeah, swap per turn. I'm very good at this. All right. No. Handyman might not be a bad one. Um... That's definitely a case of um, who we put in might die. Yes. So it might be a case of just doing someone who will die, but is only doing like chip damage. Mm-hmm. Well, you don't have to sacrifice someone, but it can be worth it to do that. I feel like it's we're saying. probably worth it here to sack someone rather than taking like a yes. bubble of damage. Um, so do we throw like the three and the two? Like, I think the three goes in Sadler's for a weekend. I might take weekend. his pirate. His pirate True. might live. Pirate has a chance to live. He's had a lot of he health. He will do two damage, two burn, and five damage here. So, yeah. Uh, so nine yeah, damage we, we do it three with the sad verse, and then yeah, I like pirate here actually. These dice work out quite nice for him. And there's a decent odds he lives. Yeah. She has to get all three of her attacks out, basically, to kill him. Pirate's a hero. We get it against all odds, which is good. We have a lot, lot of dice, so the question will be what and do. All right, let's roll these dice. Here Probably again. Singer again. Singer will definitely die if we bring True. her out. True. Um, we do have potential for burning. Um, we... Yeah, Wicker Man wouldn't be too bad um, as a dump that we don't also, care if he dies. Also, wouldn't be too bad to bring out Jester with the thoughts of healing him with mm -hmm. the two hearts mm -hmm. that are available. Um, because, well, he would only do 10 damage at this point. Yeah. Which mostly be he would take the, um... The brunt. The brunt. Giving up Wicker Man doesn't seem like the worst thing in the world. Like, he'd do pretty good damage. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, um, he'd even heal a little bit with the, uh, six if we use that. Yeah, so if we heal a little bit of the six. Yeah. So basically, one of these fives is going Yes, the five here. goes in there. Um, some other stuff goes in. Uh, so probably, if we're using Wicker, which is actually, I think, a good idea, yeah. Yeah. Like, if um, he dies, I don't think it's the worst thing. I think it's just these twos, then. Yeah. I know it does 12 damage. Wait, do we win? 12 plus we know. 4 plus Five 3. 5 health. 5 health. Um, yeah. No, I feel like this is going to do good damage. Yeah. There's a chance he lives and we'll kill her next turn. Exactly. Guaranteed, no matter what. Yes. So. Yeah, because he even gets the health back from Flytrap. <laughs> And he does almost as much damage, yep. so... Especially with the burns, which she will take. Yeah, Wicker Man lives. Yep. Nice. Poor Wicker Man, always taking punches and getting massive weakens. Alright, well, we can switch to Jester and we win. Yep. If we had a three, I would get that health gladly, but yeah. we, uh, we don't. We do so. not. All right. It doesn't matter. What did we roll? Punch it. All right. Oh boy, so yeah, she is terrifying. She's just like baby squid, but uh, more. Okay, so Jester's at 20 health, which is good. We definitely heal up Singer. No, she only has 22. All right, yeah, Singer's real good. Yeah, the question is if we heal up, like, Wicker Man or someone, especially with Jester having 20 health and an apple behind him. Yeah, it's an I interesting think with question. the cow cow is kind of scary. Definitely true. Um... He rolls sixes. We're probably going to lose some people to him. It'll be a question of who. I know just does 12 12 damage, damage yes.
Can it be Wicker Man or a pirate? Yeah, I think it would probably be Wicker Man in that case. He's actually proved surprisingly good to just come in and dump a bunch of damage when we have our ultimate. Audrey will also be pretty good at that. Yeah. Like Wicker Man, Audrey, and High and uh, Singer are all quite good when we have a bunch when we have our uh, power. Alright, well, uh... Throw that two in there. Alright, um, so what can we do with a bunch of five? Oh, uh, well, Audrey can get, um, I can put like one in One there, headbutt and, and then the get... super weaken, which is actually probably pretty good. Well, that and what we might do is just do wind up fest for five damage and then do the super weaken. Ooh, yeah. Because, yeah, the Super Weekend seems really strong. How long is it cat? Ouch. Chef, rolled two sixes anyway. He sure did. One asshole. All right. Well, against all odds with Audrey is quite really, really good. Yep. Um, God, what do we even switch over? So we definitely do, like, two headbutts and Earthquake, and then we'll see who we switch to. That is part that leads us with Possibly. Um, um, yeah, he can do... A little risky if we don't get the kill, um, because Cowboy's going down to nine health here, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. We do six it shots with Jester, just but to not the wind-up punch. Else. Yeah, I think we switch to someone else who can die, because the Jester only has a chance of getting a kill. Win, but and that's win. terrifying. Yeah. Especially because I think we want to use our last health on Audrey. I think we do, for sure. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright, um... The farmer can't use it, Baby Squid can't use it. Um, we could get a shock. Yeah, Handyman did do a but shock, though he is weakened right weaken. now. Um, here we get five weakened. Um... Might be Pirate to just take the fall and then next turn we finish. Yeah. Yeah, we know Jester could win, we just only, don't really want to take the damage. We would have to roll a combo of seven with the uh, juggling ball, which yeah. may or may not happen. Mm -hmm. I'm okay with letting the pirate take the snack. Pirate's a hero for the cause. Yep. Go ahead. Uh, Jester. Yeehaw! Alibi is good. Alright, let's heal Audrey. She's excellent. Mm hmm. Alright. Well, Yeehaw. I like having singer Audrey and Wicker Man. Alright. Because, uh, let's see how this goes. <laughs> Lady Luck Ooh, changes okay. equipment Change every turn. turn. Oh my. It seems like she's gonna be utterly terrifying. Um. Oh, sure, we made lots of friends. Yeah. Try your rug. I just need absolute power. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so yes, we will definitely want to keep an eye on we her gonna every turn. Swap Jester the hell out as well. Does three times damage. That wears ah okay. Oh my. Okay, so we have a bunch of people with hats, right? Yes, we have like cowboy, cowboy has a hat. We have a six. We do here. have a six. Alright, so I think I'm gonna throw the uh <laughs> Uh, possibly just the three as well, mm -hmm. like, do six damage to her. <sighs> Alright, um, do I do the five damage and then switch to, uh, Cowboy? Yes, because Midnight Charm is ten, I believe. So we Jester would only take one damage as well, he does have a hand. Yes, though but we're switching. Yes. we want to switch just to get the most out of our, uh, damage here. Yes, absolutely, it's just like, uh, does Audrey's headband count? All right, Honeyman also has a uh, keeper, so we're gonna... Rat King destroys Lady Luck. That's pretty good. All right, so <laughs> Cowboy? I think so. With the six that we have, 
start rolling into uh, Midnight Charm as well. Hmm. Holy. All right. Well, let's uh, take a look at her <laughs> equipment now. Hey, Ty. They reckon you want bananas when so that sounds about right. All right. Um, Judgment and Divine Ash. Shield. Green thing can only take one. God, I don't know if we have... Anything we have green? the handyman, but we, he doesn't have a shield. Right. Um. And yeah, what luck? She got all sixes. Hmm. Yeah, um, I don't think we have anything that generates no, shield at all. No, no. So um, something die. Whatever we put out now dies unless it's like. So I think we have enough to do three sixes. Mm-hmm. Um, because we can roll two six, we can do eighteen damage, and then swap over to someone else, and then swap to, to someone who's probably going to die. Yeah. yeah. And we'll use divine axe first. I assume Audrey counts as green, but doesn't have shield, and I'd rather not lose. No. Um, so it's probably, it's possibly just, um, like, Baby Squid dying. Baby or... Squid, you hero! I get the feeling we will be forced to swap into another one, it's worth noting, but we can pick someone green for that shot. Hmm. <laughs> no, Baby Squid! Yeah, I can pick like the handyman. Um, all right. And Baby Squid is. <laughs> Baby Squid is a hero. Died for our sins. <laughs> ah, used that first. That's a problem. No, <laughs> we got our limit break, shockingly. Is her turn continue? Um, I, I don't know. She can only kill one person around. Okay, yeah. that's good. Then we have our ability. Who do we want to start on and who do we want to yeah, swap who's to? Yeah, strong? I mean, Audrey's Audrey is a very pretty good to start, start with. Start. Yeah. Yeah, yeah Cactus is green and shield. And, yeah. Okay, her turn ends. That's good to know. Yeah, I like kind of Audrey and then we swap ah. in and now, ah. We may have blown up the uh, UI a little bit, but oh, yes, but... she's now getting another thing. Yeah, we start with Audrey, mm -hmm. I think, for... Against all odds, we'll do some fucking work there. Now we have uh, green things and hat green. wearers. Shields. Uh, Handyman would not die to either of those, but will die to that. Yes. Um, okay, so... Just okay, God, we really need to get rid of that shield thing because she can kill us until we get rid of that shield thing. Or, like, she can kill someone every turn. Yeah, I think we have to throw the uh, handyman out. I think so. That or, like, the wicker yeah, man. We can also weaken. I have no idea what weaken does. Too. True, weaken might help. Yeah, we'll see what weaken does. <laughs> Alright, and then... Three dice, no matter Honeyman what. Honeyman can combine. Um, so if we do bring him out, which I think we do. No, we recruited everyone that we could. Yeah, we, we lost... Um, Hothead. Hothead, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we don't get to see until... All right, um, so we switch to Honeyman, you think? Think so. There might even be a chance he lives, depending on how good the weakens are. And the uh, well, we are gonna shock, so we'll see how that fucks it up as well. Mm. Unless we don't want to shock. I almost wonder, yeah, if we just don't shock. Can we just do four damage? Um, we can always like. Well, fi yeah, yeah, five fine. plus two. Yeah, we'll see what the weaken three does. We definitely don't didn't have anything in our party that um, has shield. Yeah. Yeah, with all the dice, shock is actually like not great. You'd rather take the weakens. Okay. Ah. 
Interesting. I think she could have killed us there. She sure could have. All right. Um. Well, this is fine. All right. Well. Um. I think shocker. Uh. Check her equipment nice. again. Issue commandments. Um. What does that <laughs> do? Well, we're gonna do some learning. Shock it. Here we go. All right, so yeah, the question is who we uh, swap to. Mm. This is phase two. Yeah, well, time to do some learning. Yeah, so I wonder if we do pea shooter and then switch to the fireman because he can do two, mm. two burning Get dice some burns and eight in, damage. just some, some cheeky burns. True, it wouldn't be a final boss if we only had one phase. <coughs> and you know, if he dies and whatever's of weirds about to happen, it's not the worst thing in the world. Yeah. Oh god. She's very fairly. She will have to take both the shocks thanks to yeah. the uh or both the burns thanks to the shock, so there's yeah. that. <laughs> hmm? What? Hi? Yeah. Uh-oh. Ah, she starts adding rules. Don't use sixes, you'll lose five health. Okay. Honestly, I think that's... Gain a random blessing, do damage, if enemy HP is full, do double. Oh okay. my, all right. Um, so she's gonna do six damage or 12 damage. Oh, uh, we do have people not at, at like... Yeah, not at full health. Yeah, so we could even switch to like... Audrey if we wanted. Mm-hmm. We'd be able to do weakens on uh, on her too with the earthquake. Yeah, that might mean um, no. Of course, it would ask if we would want to do the six. If we want to take five health. I think I'm gonna let Fireman take five damage. But yeah. Just using the, the six Penalty here. only fires once. Good to know. And fallen rules, you go hog wild. Okay. Okay, I'm hog wild. Yeah. Um. All right. So if I switch. Okay. To... So Audrey can't get the weaken, but. I'm blessing is definitely. Oh, but um, singer can. Singer could. Singer yes. can get two. Uh, is and she at full health, find... or is she a little damaged? I'm I think she's a little damaged. damaged. Should be good. Well, I think we are switching off now, so let's take a look. Yes, yeah, singer does in fact. Yes. So she goes down to twelve here. This is hardly terrifying. <laughs> We should also, I think, get against all odds next turn, so that's uh, a decent it's nine chance of finding it. So ah, not. true. I didn't realize it was that much. Yeah, it's a lot. It needs sixes, you say. Makes it tough. Ah, so she's now getting damage reduced by two. Next turn, blind all dice, or don't use any count. Oh, don't reduce any countdowns. The penalty for defying is blind all dice. Next okay. turn. And what's her equipment now? Divine Hammer, 2x shock all equipment. Okay. That's me. All right, so that's 12 damage, huh? Um, so I think we do sad verses here. Mm-hmm. And then Weekend throw out someone. Weekend doesn't really seem to do very much to her, no. though. Um, admittedly. All right. I still think the uh, the damage that we get on this is nice, and then we could just throw out someone who uh, yeah. takes 12 damage. Um... Um, okay. And then, so we don't want to reduce countdowns because I think we don't want to blind our dice. Do we just let the fireman die? He has five health, so it would actually be... He takes seven less damage by letting him die, and we get, um, eight damage plus two burns? Yeah, that seems pretty good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes. Two burns. Oh, well. I'll just have to do it. Ah! That's way better, that's actually. That's a real good weekend, actually. Okay. Wow. Good to All keep right. that in mind. Don't use ones, and we'll get five poisons. That's really bad if we use our ones. If I use a one to unlock the fireball, does that count? I imagine it will, but I don't know. Uh, yeah, so what are our, uh, her equipment now? Divine Dagger, one damage plus one each use, and she has five dice. 
That feels like something we'd really want to weaken. Yeah, I feel like we can switch to do uh, a weaken. Yeah. And then maybe just ignore our one. So we might use the five and the six, then turn back to Singer and Singer and, use and the do three. a weaken and see if she lives. It's that or like Audrey, which gets the five and the six in the countdown thing, but then that would be all that she do. See, so yeah, I think that's probably where we want to be. Six damage with it. Um... I think Singer might be a little bit. Oh, well, the six damage with the fireball and the three, that is actually more with the Singer. She has yeah. only one bit of gear, so we don't need Yes, we don't weekend. need Mega Weekend here. All right, so let's go ahead. Go. Let's hope that damage is reduced. But even if not, Singer's done work. We will... Uh, yep. See what happens. You know what we can do on fours, does she? Uh, no. no. <laughs> okay, we reduced uh, the damage. Yes, because it's the three uses. Okay, and we got against all odds with Singer out, which is pretty good. Don't reduce any countdowns. Ah. Yeah, you were thinking of Shovel. Yeah, I was like, man, that doesn't have a thing. So, yeah, boy, and it's Inflict 5 Poison, too, so that's a pretty tough rule to break. Hmm, and uh, her gear. Okay, just Divine Sword. So she doesn't actually have a huge damage output next turn. Yeah, I still, well, I still think we do sad, but I think we roll. Um, so we'll take the 5 Poison here. No? Reduce countdowns. Oh, the they're, sad they're not, they're not Sorry. countdowns. I, I was, I was very, her. I was very confused there. I was like, Sorry. no, no. Uh, gonna... What are we doing with this abundance of dice we have? But um, yeah, the fours well, and the sad verses yes. are good. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Um, yeah. What are we doing with this? Um. So I mean, we could do twelve damage at the cost of taking five a poison, lot which is poison. quite a bit. Um, I assume it would mean just the singer is poisoned, or does that affect everyone? I assume that it's just a status, which means oh, that whoever's God, out at the start yeah, of your yeah. turn takes right. the damage. So that's a lot of damage to take. Yeah. Um, so, Space Marines countdown, um, Aubrey's countdown, Jester's countdown, um, Animan's countdown. God, I feel like, yeah, most of our ones that do lots of damage are countdown. Yeah, like Fireman's not countdown. We won't get used, be able to use like four of the dice, but that might still be fine. Well, it would still be 10 damage. Yeah, because it's 10 burn. damage and two burn, which is seems pretty nice. He also, I don't, he will die. Yeah, Cowboy's um, countdown, unfortunately. Yeah. yeah. Everyone's like countdown. Yep. Um... Yeah, Wicker Man is as well. So yeah, it probably is just Fireman. Um, who will die, it's fine. Yeah, it would be that or like Wicker Man to just do the six damage and heal up and then not die. Um, or if like the 14 damage of Fireman is just worth more, which it might be. An interesting question. Oh, tricky, 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 tricky. I know, this is actually really tough to like think what we want to do here. All right, I think I'm going to Fireman. I think getting the damage in here is good. Fireman has done some fucking work. He sure has. All right, I think I'm going to bring Aubrey out. Mm-hmm. Um, she's... <laughs> <he's> still <laughs> Uh-oh, still there. Um, I think Audrey is just a really good starter. Mm-hmm. Yeah, have her out and then switch away so that she doesn't have to take the damage. Don't switch fighters. Uh, what does she have? Reduce health to one. Okay. Um, so it might be worth her healing 10 health here. I don't think we actually care about that too, too If we much. do enough damage, it doesn't matter. Yeah, that's um, actually fine, right? I feel like... If we, we, yeah, if we switch to Singer and weaken that, she'll gain a net of three health, but we'll weaken her, and I think yeah. that's worth it. Like, or that sounds could, way better. We can also not switch and just weaken it, actually. 
Um, we can do four, and we can actually just weaken here. Yeah, I guess the question is if. Uh, and not switch, she doesn't take the health. Yeah. And then I feel like the weaken. Whatever it weakens to is really the question. Yeah. It can't kill her, so fuck it. True. Right? You know. But yeah, let's. Uh... It's good damage, and, and we are getting there. Weekend. Like we're we just yeah. got past the good number. We still have seven fighters. Yeah. You know? I, I we're doing really good, honestly. I mean, like half health or yep. yeah. That's like ten damage. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. This is against all else too. Yep. All right, are we going into phase three? Try your rug. I'm ashamed to end it all. Oh. <laughs> 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 all right, what's she doing now? Ah. 20 damage, burn, burn all dice. All yeah, she's dice. just gonna meteor us. Um, all right. All right, so I could do 12 damage with headbutt. I've also got a six and a two, so we can switch to someone else mm -hmm. uh, who can use that. So I yes. feel like that's pretty good. We also weaken that, which is good. I feel like we don't have anyone who takes half I think Fireman, fire. yeah, actually, who even does take half from fire? Because most know. enemies yeah. actually just take double from ice when they're fire enemies. All right, so, all three, yeah. So, we've got the weaken. I'm knowing how much damage it will do weaken. Yeah. Um, what can we do? What can so we we've do? got... Cowboy, we've got Handyman, um, who probably wouldn't be the worst. Uh, Shock will interfere with them. True, yes. Wicker Man would heal a little bit of health, but he does take double from fire. He does take double, it might, yeah, I'm not doing Wicker Man, he will just die no matter um, what. So it might be like Cowboy, uh, maybe, for an extra six damage. He is at 19 health. Yes, it's Cowboy. I, I think Cowboy's the only one that Space Marine just doesn't get anything here. Yes. The and extra six damage shock, is nice, so. and yeah, we don't want to shock. And he can even roll his Midnight Charm a little. We, we're gonna learn what Meteor Minus is. 10 and damage, Verna Dice. I thought that was the case. Yep. Yeah, but I would kill Wicker Man. Yes. <laughs> Wicker Man is extremely weak to fire. Mm -hmm. I rolled a six, nice. 30 damage inflicts uh, 99 curse. I see. Um, we want to weaken the shit out of that, right? Mm -hmm. um, is this the turn we give up Singer? I feel like probably she's like the easiest yes. one. Yes. Um, so we throw the six and six shooter and then uh, swap over. I think so. We take the burn here for the midnight to like roll a midnight charm down a little bit more too. I think so, yeah. Because that kind of sets him up for next time we pull him out. And nine damage, nine health versus seven health doesn't seem that different. I'm gonna put the four and the three in yes. the uh, thing here. And that's still a six, so we can turn a six into two sixes with him. Six becomes 12 damage. Is it 31 health? Let's oh, see what that's happens. Terrifying. <laughs> 20 damage, 99, 99 curse. So next turn is gonna be um hell. Oh, I do not like this one a little bit. No. Alright. This um, might just be like a turn where we throw out someone who we are fine with dying, because like 99 curse means we don't get much. Aubrey. For the 50% um, chance that we actually do get something useful. Well, curse only last this turn? Does it I go assume away? so. I think it'll just be this turn. Lima Cowboy? Alright. Space Marine is like potentially useful, but... Does curse get reset with a death? It does seem like 99 Curse does seem nasty. Um, uh, I kind of, I, I think maybe Aubrey. Start out with Audrey and then switch to someone to just explode. We'll see if, uh, okay, yep, Curse oh. is all gone. Fuck Curses. Who needs them? 
Excellent. All right, uh, what does she have? Almost there. 25 damage. Freeze, freeze all, all dice. dice. Okay. Pass is clear on death. All right, well, we can do uh, 10 damage. Yeah, that only crushes for you to survive, and uh, it's fair. Hilarious. So you actually probably don't want to live in that turn. You probably do want to like, Yeah, you want someone, someone to die. <laughs> Cause that All just right. fucks your entire turn if you don't. <laughs> we end up with four left over. Alright, um... All right, um, so yeah, what comes out now? Who wants to get froze? Who wants to Let it go. Die. All right, um. Who wants to frozen the shall movie? Shall we just uh, get Space Marine killed? What a hero. <laughs> what a boy. Space Marine. Get Come on, her. Space Marine. It's gonna be like 10 damage. 12 damage is exactly lethal. <laughs> Hilarious. Ah. John Halo died for our sins. Sure did. All right. Um, so I think it's probably just over again. She's real good. Mm-hmm. Um, that's a bit of a weird one. You can headbutt and swap wait. to Jester. Um, yeah, what she, what she got before I put Jester out. Um, okay, shot. Um. Cause she'll do six we damage. Could we could oh, we could switch to Caroline. I think we win. Cause he has like nine. We get like three sixes. That's eighteen damage, right? Yes. That's a win. Yeah, we do the six in, and then we throw the cowboy in. Oh, don't, we don't even. Need oh to yeah, do we that. don't even Cowboy need has to do that. like three yeah. uses. I can though. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Head button and shoot with a gun. <laughs> Well, howdy! Now I set up for the win! Yeehaw! Go, cowboy! <clears throat> Jester did no damage to Lady Luck. <laughs> Look. Because we were too terrified to her... ever bring him out. Just, they beat her with the power of friendship. It's fine. Nice. Hmm. Oh, hello. Yahaha! Well, we sure did. It's a very good delegation. What's happening? <laughs> you you won, Jester. Mm -hmm. You won. <laughs> <laughs> you silly Billy. Ah. Oh no, ma. Hell yeah, we did, but you're still here, so... It's fine. And you're not mad? <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, we did. I don't know. Um, oh. forever? <laughs> you not fetch the records? <laughs> <laughs> you're not my boss! Sure, we did beat her, we didn't kill her. There are no records. <laughs> Baby Squid! Baby Squid! Favorite lad. We got him killed, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you're not wrong, Jester. Mm -hmm. But then where's you're the not, fun in that? You're not wrong. Yeah. You Sure, uh -huh. our jury of self-realization. Mm-hmm. Pose for a photo. Beautiful, baby, yeah. Can we leave now? Nope. Oh yeah. Whee! Oh, she is fair after all. Hmm. No. <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Yeah, are we gonna transform uh, back? 
true, you are just better as a giant dice, right? Give that warrior a monster truck, he deserves it. <laughs> Getting used to the dice thing, it's true, you do get used to it. What about the minions? Can they leave? Yeah. It's true. I never would have made it out. The power of friendship won. <laughs> it's true. They do live down here. It's very cozy. Do they want to leave, though? They were. It's true. They were very. Yeah, we believe. Very. Yeah. You know, see, let's ask them if they want to leave. They can. <laughs> <laughs> Open up that employee suggestion box. And increase everyone's holiday leave. Uh, from zero to zero? <laughs> yeah. Double it. Increase it from nothing. Hell yeah. Sneezy probably does want to leave pretty fast. It's a shame we didn't meet Sneezy. Mm hmm. <laughs> it's fine. It's, it's pretty decent confetti. Alright. We learned how it cards, I guess. I and isn't cannot, that the greatest lesson I of all? I cannot fucking believe we finished the game. Today. We beat it today. We did not Surprise. expect to get the witch bonus round in, in one, one go. <laughs> like we die on the witch so often off stream. And then never on stream. And then never on stream. It's fine. I can find he's still going. Mm hmm. Yeah, sure, we'll come back. It's true. The real dicey dungeon was the friends we made along the way. All right. Uh, pop. That mimic rule. <laughs> that mimic was... run was amazing. Mimic run was fantastic. Who uh, needs to know who, what's who, going when, on? You don't need to know the enemies. They're all chests, yeah. which is just better. Fuck they're it. just they're all chests. Beta testers. Organizations. Mimic Run was very good. <laughs> Mimic Run was great. We've had some really good runs. And now we're gonna have to figure out what we want to do next with this. Yeah. Like, I have no God, idea yeah. how different the other boss runs are mm -hmm, from mm -hmm. this one. Well, that's, yeah, that's something else to do is the boss runs. Because people are saying, like, the Jester gets the minions. So I don't mm -hmm. know what everyone else gets. Mm -hmm. It could be fun to do Lady Luck for those people. We have um, heard of mods. We haven't. We seen have not them. played any of the mods. No. All right. Yeah, it might be fun to do some uh, stuff with that. I've heard many yes, quests. Yes, we haven't done the uh, Halloween episodes. Um, we also, yes, we never did do those. All right. Glad I can leave now. I lived in the dungeon for hundred years. Can't blame me for getting homesick sometime. Turns out you love my Dicey Dungeons video, so I'm back for more. I mean, oh god, we're streaming yep, this right there we now. Go. This is getting meta now. Hello, fourth wall. <laughs> Please watch our non Dicey Dungeons content as well. Um, I'm not stretched by trying to skate. Maybe we'll be able to figure out how this place works. Maybe. Mm -hmm. You never know. In time with my friends, keep myself sharp. I brought some colorful gifts to the monsters. Aww. Quend. And I might not have a billion dollars if I don't have the go kinds that be worth a lot in the outside world. Fair enough. You should meet Lady Lux now. I'm just having fun. Have fun staying hydrated. Fighting monsters is an amazing workout. There we go. So, yes. You also do have a decent amount of challenges to do, although I'm not sure that's something we'll do on stream so much. A lot of them are the weird nope. ones, but uh. <gasps> <laughs> Aww. Aww, you love shrimp! Aww, you just want to be left alone down here forever. <laughs> Happy for when the dice came back to fight again! It was so nice of them! Aww. Wanted to be a great big giant squid, not just a wee baby. No, you be a wee baby squid. You're adorable. Aww. You know what we want. They know what we want. Good want baby. All the good babies. We sure do. We have gotten a few of them. We've gotten a decent number of the weird ones, but there are definitely a oh, lot. Oh, there's a lot of weird ones. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, well, this stream went long. Yeah, well, sometimes you just end up fighting the final boss. It yeah, happens. Sometimes you don't expect to fight the final boss. Yeah. You end up fighting the final boss. Exactly. So we're going to figure out what the hell we're doing next week. Um, 
Maybe a mod, maybe the Halloween stuff, maybe more Lady Luck runs. We Who shall knows? see. Something. Something or other. Something. All right. Sunday, we are back with more uh, Sekiro. Indeed. So we'll see you guys on Sunday as he, I don't know, what are you doing, Sekiro? Uh, we're going through Mibu Village. Okay. So zombie town. We're, we are um, trying to sever immortality. That's as one fun. does. That we're There is some disagreement on how to do it, but we'll smooth that out. We'll figure it out. See you guys on Sunday. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye.